Hey everyone, my name is Danilo Petrovic. I'm Ilya Marchenko. I'm Dennis Kuda. I'm Evgeny Donsko. I'm Henry Laksan. I'm Peter Torepko and, and you are listening to the Game to Love podcast. Hey, welcome back, tennis fans. Here we go. It is Dominic Team. He is up against, well, the home countryman, Lorenzo Sanego in this matchup. JG, we've got sort of our, our heritage behind us. I've got my grandmother here behind me with the Austrian flag, and you've got your family Italian flag there. My, my grandmother as well, mate. I feel like we stick with the grandmother theme. Oh, all right, we've nice. got grandmothers <laughs> from each country. Sanego today, I actually believe in him as well. It's not just it's not just there for the vibes. Um, yeah. This Italian flag, I honestly think today Lorenzo Sanego can cause an upset and beat Dominic Team. He's looked good recently. We saw what he's capable of doing on the big stage last year, beating Djokovic. Yeah. Um, and this year he's not been too bad at all. Um, I know you've got. I'll just share the screen. Sure. So you can see there. There's a lot of green. He's been beating some good players as well. We've not seen him really so much on. Um, we didn't see him in Spain, did we? Which was a bit disappointing. No, Not in no. Barcelona or Madrid. But Monte Carlo, he started that well, beating Mark, Martin Fuksovic. You know how good he is. Uh, I think really that was good. really, really convincing and just shows how good this guy can play because, as we see, Definitely. team struggled against Martin. Um, he just about got through. Obviously, the third set, he bageled him, but it wasn't wasn't that straightforward for him. And then Mega beat Mega straight sets. He only really lost to Zverev there, beat Monfils. Yep. who's returning. I know he's not in good form, but it's still going on face regardless of everything. So I think today, Lorenzo Sanego in Italy against Dominic Team, who is not the Dominic Team we're accustomed to. He's not no. the ruthless guy we, we know on the clay. Not the Prince of Clay we spoke about as the guy who's going to be winning and challenging uh, Rafa for French Opens. He still looks a little bit out of sorts. I think that performance against Zverev in Madrid was really disappointing from him. Yeah. However, he has bounced back slightly. And I think him coming from a lot of adversity in the match against Fuchsovic to come through and win and the nature he did the third set, he's definitely improving. Um, yeah. But I'm still sticking with it, mate. Lorenzo Sanego, forza, come on, let's do this. Well, it's the evening match, isn't it? And the Italian crowd are in good voice there. They've been treated to what was an epic matchup this afternoon between, well, Denis Shapovalov. He yeah. really took the game to Rafael Nadal, gave him the game of his life out there. Three hours, I think, wasn't the match. And Over three hours, well over three hours, it seems. Raf Rafa had to come back from the depths of despair. So these yep. fans have been given a treat. And all they need is the icing on the cake, which would be Lorenzo Sanego defeating Dominic Team, surely. But yep. Dominic Team. He looked in good form in the third set against Fuchskovic. He actually bageled him. So, so Dominic Team, he's got some uh, stats coming up here. His best performance is semi final in 2017, and his win percentage is 63%. So, hmm. not bad, but not seen much of him recently. You'd expect slightly better. Um, one thing, I think the tips have disappeared off the screen. Oh, apologies. I don't, I don't know, know why if I'm going to pop them up. Sorry, I think I was playing around with some other bits earlier. There they go. Yeah. There we go. Just... They're all there. I'm talking about the tips. We've got Thomas Rock. He's pushed in front. He did a little sneaky one on the side <laughs> on PayPal. <laughs> Jordan's been pushed to two. We've got Shane there, uh, Anna, and Vance. So, well, thanks to all you guys. Uh, let's see if anyone else can join. Obviously, only $5, and you'll be on the leaderboard for May. Yeah, $5, one cent. Uh, and then you can push on there. As you can see, these two have played only once before, and that was in Kitzbühel in Austria. And Lorenzo Sonego lost in straight sets, but two close sets. Yep. There was a tie-break second set at eight six. Wouldn't say that team steamrolled him at all. Well, especially in, especially in Austria, maybe you'd yep. expect something a little bit better. I think the odds sort of uh, were predicting him to do a lot better as well. Hmm. Um, and just one thing I was going to say. Uh, talking about that, sorry, I forgot completely what I was talking about. But the other match, I know you were talking about. Sorry, I was watching this as as you was talking. No, but the El Shapovalov, we need to talk about it because my yeah. man has gone through, and what a battle it was between them two. Epic. I thought it was so good. I'm just really disappointed we wasn't able to cover it on the live uh, uh, watch alongs. I but know. we had work, me and Ben. But we was we was watching out of the corner of our eye, bits and bobs here and there. And yep. uh, I thought Shapovalov was really good. 
He really, really was. He impressed me so much. Yep. I think it and, was a, just a welcome surprise, wasn't it? I don't, everybody yeah. thought, oh, don't worry, Rafa's got this. It's only Chapeau on clay. And then look what happened. He was four love down in the first set, three love down in the second set. How Rafa's never out of it, though. You just know, you just knew. I said that to you. I messaged you. I just, I said, there's a comeback somewhere yeah. here. I know it. You know it. <laughs> it's in. It's always in the storyline with Rafa Nadal on clay uh, and in these big tournaments. I just, I think he's going to be feeling a bit tired after that Sinner match last night, Chapeau match this afternoon. Who's he up against next? Well. He's well, we've be... obviously got Sverev and Nishikori playing right now. Yeah. But I think I think Nadal's not going to be. He's going to feel good. I think he's going to feel full of confidence, knowing that he was able to defeat a sha- an informed Shapovalov who was serving well, as James is saying there, yep. and looked very solid. There was a few little errors he made in big moments, but Rafa was making them as well. And I thought there was nothing really between them too much. Just Rafa, some of the shots he made at big times was just showing why he is the greatest on this surface and. Um, I was just really, really inspired by the performance. I was there screaming at my phone watching it. Um, <laughs> so I'm sure loads of people were as well. But let's focus on today's match because we've got Dominic Team, Lorenzo Saneo. Obviously, Ben touched on that they played each other once before. Yes. Team leads the hit head to head for what's going to happen here in Rome. Yeah, team serving first. They've just, uh, well, they're not just come out on court. They've warmed up now. He's serving uh, from the bottom, if you are watching on the on the TV. And Sonego powers it long. And the first point goes to Dominic Team. Nice there outfit. I quite like it. The grey with the black. Who are, you, who are we speaking about? Or the pink, like the little pink thing. Oh, but at least Dominic he's not Team. Got the, at least he's I like not got both the Mac- of them, to be fair. I like Team's and Sonego's outfit. Team's going to be happy he's playing the evening session. He doesn't have to wear the MAGA hat tonight. <laughs> so I think that was what's been asked. Uh, like preventing him playing his best tennis. All of yeah, that I've not neg- seen him play well with the MAGA hat. <laughs> no, I haven't either. He looks very down and, de- and dejected when he's playing in it. And I don't like seeing that Dominic team. Well, he whipped it off the other day, didn't he? Really good shot here from Sonego, yeah. though. Forces Ooh. him around and finishes it with a drop shot. And very I'm good. telling you right now, mate, it's going to be a straight set uh, victory for Lorenzo Sonego today. Mate, well, your winner's out. I know you've got him to win the whole thing here. I know it's dangerous, dangerous. I nearly was out in the first round. I think, I think Dominic team's just warming up. I think Lorenzo Sonego could take the first set here today. I think Dominic team does him in three. You're going to see another comeback. We're gonna. It's going to be and the day you of had the to comeback. Say that though, you're desperate for a team win. You know how much it's going to mean for your bracket. Um, but guys, oh. let us know in the chat. What do you think? Uh, of this outcome of this match today. Who who are you backing? Dominic Team or Lorenzo Sonego? Yeah, I mean, I just want to address James there. The worst possible start to my day today. It just feels like it's been an emotional roller coaster as I had to watch Karatsev crash out this morning to Riley Opelka. We all knew it was possible. He had set point. In the first set in the tie, but and you got one chance. One mm. chance is all you get with Riley Opelka, and he didn't. He missed the, the shot down the line, and the set went. And then, yeah. as you know, one break is all it takes for Riley Opelka. And he threw... came close, but it wasn't good enough. Let's be no. honest; he's a little bit more consistent than that usually. And Opelka punished him. Um, and ever think... since I was slandering Opelka, I think Mate. there was something like he's had two clay court victories in his career or something he's had three this week so i said big john he did well riley opelka's carrying the the flame now or the flag john historically has done all right on clay in the in the past opelka's never done anything on clay until this tournament i'm not gonna lie i don't think he looked good at all opelka he just served great and he did hit the odd one or two good shots that's all he needs though and those one or two good shots will get him a break or a tie break. And that's it. Ooh, did that land in from Sonego? It nah, it just missed. Board. Just, just missed. wide. Clipped Don't the net, me. forced it wide, and team holds. One love. That's it. Well, Shaddai saying team straight sets win. Hello, guys. How you doing, Shaddai? Good How to have you in. So, <laughs> that's Prabesh saying Sonego, the overextended grunter. Does not deserve uh, 
to win a point, never mind a match. Well, I think he will be winning. He's already won one point. I think he'll be uh, he'll be running him close today. Dominic team isn't going to have it all his own way. So now he goes a power player, and you know that Dominic team suffers sometimes when he's on the back foot. He gets his head down, especially if Sine goes, well, if he exposes some of team's regular weaknesses, let's say, like the backhand. So, Very colourful outfit, actually, Sine goes. More, more colourful than I thought it was. <laughs> a, little bit of a little bit of a tie-dye number. Yeah, maybe I'm not so keen on it now. As I'm seeing it closer from afar, it looked okay, but I'm not got, so sure on that look. We got Tevin joining us, saying, "Hey guys, how you doing, Tevin? Good to have you in, bud." And Martin saying thoughts on Del Bonis. Yeah, I thought Del Bonis was going to be the one going through against Felix. He did yeah. fairly comfortably. It's going to be him versus Opelka next round. That's a pick. I, I was surprised. I was surprised Del Bonis went for him. I know you did definitely call it. I remember you saying, I was actually thinking Felix could have a nice run here. But yet again, Felix getting deep in tournaments and he's just disappointed. I yeah. just, I don't know. I don't want to be too negative on the guy, but it's hard not to be uh, the yeah. last few years. However, well done for Del Bonis. Furthest he's ever been in a grand, uh, in, a, in a Masters tournament. Um, and I think it'll be first semi final in a Masters for either a Pell Cup or Del Bonis now. So great achievement for both of them. Wow. Uh, Pizan, well, great for whoever goes through, not yeah, both of them will go through. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> well, at least it opens up the opportunity for one of them to have a good tournament. Uh, Pizan, if you want to watch the match live, uh, it's on Amazon Prime, or if you have a gambling account, or Tennis TV, or, or, jump our, or jump in our Discord. Someone's probably got it on in there, no doubt. We've got Vitor from Brazil, and he's going, let's go team. Yeah, interesting yeah. one and one thing i think we're going to see a lot today is drop shots i think we've seen maybe two or three already from sanego not all of them have been successful but he will do it a lot that's a lot a very much part of his game he's yes. a typical clay court player uh brought up on the clay courts and that's what really made him rise through the rankings especially on the challenger tour and stuff and now um you you can see that he's very dangerous with them he know he can read the courts well weird background if a team to do well in this match, I think he needs to keep more baseline kind of stuff. I think so as well. I think his power play is very, very effective. The one-two punch, you're going to be seeing a few of those here today. And I think, I think that drop shot, don't overuse it, but just wait until team likes to stand quite far back. Just use it at the right time. Very powerful serve there from Sonego, though. Great stuff. Yeah, good start for him. And he's tied it up at one all. Well, one game all. Convincing service hold from both players so far. I'm yeah. impressed by Sonego. The crowd are getting behind him. How big a factor do you think the crowd are going to be in this match? Um, I think they've been quite vocal. I feel like maybe there was a bit disrespectful to Shapovalov earlier. I feel like there was a lot of... Um, jaunting when he was like taking a serve and maybe some stuff which was a bit out of the rule book and I'm a Nadal fan but I thought it was a bit unfair on him but then he's someone who gets very he can't handle it either the pressure too much and he, he definitely was looking up to the crowd so many times complaining at them so I think today team someone who's more experienced on tour I look at him as like an old head on the tour I know he's not that old but he just feels like he's been around for a bit yeah. And he knows his way around. I don't think the the crowd's going to really phase him. We're going to see probably his level, which he's playing at right now, and that'll be that. So it's up to Sonego. Whether or not the the, the, the crowd's oh, going to inspire great. him is another matter. Sorry. Great inside out forehand there from team. He's going to need to be hitting the winners. I prefer him with the headband on as well. He looks more like the Dominic team of old now. He hits the ball better when he's got that on, not that red hat. <laughs> Nice whip on that forehand as well. Both players hitting the ball well. Could this be the match of the day? Can this eclipse Nadal Chapo? I think it's got the potential to. We've got to say that though, really, because we're covering it then. Mate, <laughs> I don't I know. Think, I think I would love to say it would, but it's, I, I think it's going to be hard. I think Nadal Shapovalov is one of them. One of them uh, matches you only see once in the tournament. 
But what we have seen recently is we've seen one early doors and the final lives up to it. The final in Barcelona, the Dow City Paths was epic. Your final you covered in Belgrade was pretty good as well. Yeah. And I think we've seen some good finals recently. So hopefully this one can live up to it. And still what's on the cards, mate, people haven't been speaking about, probably some have, is the potential of maybe a Djokovic-Nadal final on the clay just before uh, Roland Garros. Indeed, mate. It's potential. Don't we say it. Who was of one the other Don't. year? Was it last year? Because Schwartzman come along. Who's going to block the party this time? Maybe Don't sit a pass? It. I've not been saying it because I don't want uh, us to jinx it. Because we know the more we talk about these potential matchups like Karatsev Nadal, it didn't happen, did it? So Karatsev just went straight out in straight sets. So I'm not going to mention any possible matchups that I would like to see <laughs> just for fear of jinxing them. But on the other side of the draw, we do have, don't forget, we ha do have Novak Djokovic. Obviously, we're focused on the bottom side of the draw yeah. at the moment. Djokovic cruised through, looked pretty comfortable in his win, to be honest. Uh, and he was playing Davidovic for Kina this morning. And I thought he would cause him some problems. And he did in the first few games, but didn't in the whole run of the match. Djokovic worked him out after about three games. Yeah, yeah. Djokovic completely annihilated him and he looked a little bit better. We've not spoke about Djokovic today, but Ooh, he's someone. Yeah, brilliant shot. Sonego. Come on, Sonego. That's what we want to see. More of them. Team comes to the net and he passes him on the backhand side. He was stretching, did well to keep the rally alive. And that is actually a really well calculated shot. He didn't have to put too much pace on it. He just directed it down the line past Dominic Team. So. Dominic team facing a little bit of early adversity here. Serving 40 30. Good return from Sonego inside out forehand. Good drop shot from team. Sonego always oh, slipped a bit there when he went for it. He got there in time though. Yeah. He could have done better probably with it, but team, team won't mind. And there we go. He leads now 2 1. Nothing really to report too mad on the match. I would say maybe Sonego's had the, the point of the match so far. But then saying that, we've only had 10 minutes. So <laughs> what does that mean? Doesn't mean a lot. But team will just be happy to be holding his serve and hitting the ball well at the start of the match. Not like the Fixkovic match. Quickly, while you're on that scene, is that Red Bull thing only there because team's there? Or has it been there the whole tournament? <laughs> I don't know. Is that Obviously, he's got a lot of sponsorship with Red Bull. He does. He drinks Red Bull all the time. You see it on his Instagram photos and posts. He's always drinking a Red Bull. doesn't matter where he is, at the airport or at an event. Um, he's Austrian <laughs> and he's got a massive Red Bull next to him. I'm not sure if that's been there the whole tournament. I've never really spotted it until now. I think they wheeled it out onto court and then he jumped out of it like one of those birthday <laughs> cards. <laughs> but everyone's leaving. Where are they going? Oh, are they just entering? I think they're just entering and walking up high yeah, to get yeah, a seat. Yeah. Okay. Everyone's coming. There's there's a lot of crowds joining now. So now you go, mate. This is going to be big. This is bigger for the crowd than the earlier matchup because it's the home countrymen. They're all here. Berrettini went out earlier. This is this their last hope for this tournament? Uh, is this the only Italian left in? I need to have. Well, a you check. had Massetti go out. You've got Berrettini who went out. So I'm pretty sure, mate, this is yeah. the only Italian left. The last yeah. Italian, see? This and is on the big. women's side, I think there's not many either. This is big. This is their last hope in the tournament. So they're going to, well, pack it 25% as much as possible. Yeah. <laughs> well, let's get behind the boy, mate. I want to see him win here today. I think he's, I generally believe it. People just joining. I've actually predicted Sonego straight set. Ben's got a team in three. Let us know in the live chat what you have. And also, if you're enjoying this live watch along, we have not asked yet, but please leave us a like on this video. It'll really help us out and allows the channel to grow. And if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. Uh, we're approaching 6K very fast. It's been a hard, it's been very hard work, but uh, definitely worthwhile. Indeed. Thanks to everybody who has subscribed and everyone who has liked this video. Sonego serving 2-1 Dominic team. Looped that return back. It's gone long from Dominic team. Yeah, poor return there. Just looped one. Went for like a little moon ball. I'm not, not sure if we mishit it or not, but it was Maybe. definitely long. Another interesting matchup being brought up. Obviously, we had quite possibly one of the biggest upsets of the day, Corey Goff knocking out Arena Sabalenka earlier. We won't be seeing Sabalenka Barty again. Yeah. Corey, Corey Goff, 
Barty. Well, we jinxed it, mate. We jinxed it. We kept saying exactly. about how we're going to see Savalenka Barty again. It's not happening. And Cormary Goff's had an incredible run. The players she's beaten yep. are top draw. Uh, the first round, I think, put in Saver. Second round, Sakari. And now Sabalenka, if I'm not mistaken. I think all three are really top ta- uh, talents of the women's tour. Wow, great and volley if there. If you see, I saw the rankings. It's just getting better and better. Like 30th, 20th, enough. I and mean, then fourth in the world with Sabalenka. Yeah. So... Can she beat number one next? Because that's her next stop. She's getting higher and higher. She can't go any better than that. So if she is to beat Ashley Barty, by virtue, surely she's the favourite for the tournament then. Amazing. I think this is going to be super tough. She, her main hope, Barty being maybe a little bit fatigued. That's all yeah. I would say. Ace there. Ooh, from big Snega. serve. And that's something we've seen early doors here. The the, the serving of Sanago has been slightly better than team. He's got a bit more of a power, powerful serve um, and it's kicking off the clay quite nicely. Team needs to find his rhythm slightly with this. I've not seen the crowd or heard the crowd this loud this whole week so far. So this is promising. Maybe this I should turn their... mine up a little bit. Let me know if it's too interfering with the stream, but it is nice for me to have a little bit of sound as well. For sure. Is that interfering at all? Just let no, me know at any well, point. Let us know in the chat, guys, as well, if it is a bit too much. But I've just turned my... The crowd my is too loud, mate. Bit. I can't hear. I can barely hear you. <laughs> <laughs> Feels like you're there, does it? Yeah, mate, it does. The immersive like a... experience. Exactly you right. by Ben. That's right, mate. That's right. Two games all. And have got Juan comfort... here saying he's going to subscribe if Sanego wins. Let's hope Lorenzo can get it done then. And Juan Ash joins the family. Wow, mate. Uh, I think uh, we uh, missed the game to love there, mate. So I'm just going to quickly <gasps> jump in and get it while we can. Go for it. Sonego with the first one of the match. And it is Love 15, mate. Dominic team. What a lob that was as well. Brilliant lob from Sonego. Good start from him. Mate. This is tough times. When you've got the whole crowd against you, it's never easy. A long serve. Interesting return there from Snego. Smacked it against, I'm not sure what that was. The, the box. box. Next. <laughs> <I was laughs> the next to the net. box. <laughs> the box. Oh, into the net team. Love 30 wow. now. Not good. I know he's doing that same thing. He's like, just always like, holds his hands up. Does this pained expression every time that he misses a shot, Dominic? Team, mate. It well, is he's a always very, done that, isn't he? very characteristic, isn't it? Let's hope that he doesn't have any more problems. But the whole crowd is willing him to miss us another serve. Great serve. He steps in on the forehand, inside out. Steps in. Great inside out forehand again. Yeah, Winner. Well played, team. A lot better from him. A bit more intent, more aggressive, coming to the net. He followed up that big first serve and forced it to the back under Sanago. Couldn't get there. This Catches is gonna... the little. Uh, what, what's the name for it? The little the angle. Is that what we call it now? I'm not sure. Yeah, the angle. I think this is a real, true test for Dominic Team today. You're not going to get any easy points with Lorenzo Sanago, and he's going to have to be playing his top tennis. And I'm glad he's come out and he's been hitting some winners early. I'm interested to see where his backhand's at today, though, because we haven't really seen it. Oh, it looks quite nice there, though. Quite crisp. Nice. They're going forehand from Sonego. It's really powerful. He's got team on the... Come on! Oh. on. Yes, Sonego. Wow. That's what I want to see. Two break points. Overpowering him with the forehand. He's forced it to the backhand of team every time. And he's actually Gavin, He's getting a lot of joy from it. We're going to see two break points. And Gabriella's saying he's going to subscribe um, if Sonego wins, too. So wow. we might get we might get to six k if Sonego wins at this rate. <laughs> How's the other match going at the moment? And well, Nishikori is up a break in the third set there against Alex Zverev at the moment. That's a very intriguing matchup. Thought it was going to be a close KG affair, and it is. Yep, a bit disappointed. I had a uh, Buster beating Nishikori. Ah, okay. Well, we've got uh, Batista Agut versus Andre Rublev. That's coming up later this evening and another match in the women's side that's on the moment Muguruza is a set down against Svitolina at the moment team Ooh. attacks that one it's too good and he saves one break point 
We've got Sonia saying he's, she's never going to hit on JG again if Sonego <laughs> wins. <laughs> I'm sorry. Wow. I'm sorry, Sonia. <laughs> Dominic team, save one break point. Can he save a second one? I hope not. <laughs> what? I'm hoping on, he can. Sonigo. Into oh, the net. He saves poor, it. Poor, poor return. He showered it himself because it wasn't even that much of a good serve, was it? No, it was a bit of a looper. So a safe one. Yeah. That just went into the backhand side and he rattled it into the middle of the net, let's say. And Michael saying Bamos somehow. <laughs> Is that for earlier? For Rafa? Bit delayed. Good. Oh, I thought it was a good serve. It wasn't. It's been called out. And it's second serve on Juice. He saved two break points. Are we going to see another? Down the tee. Returned on the backhand into team's forehand inside out. He's running around the backhand, hitting these great angles on the inside out forehand. Oh, terrible drop shot from team into the net. Terrible. What happened there? I think it was a difficult ball to handle. Bit too hot to handle from the Italian. Weird choice of shot. I think he forced him out wide with the inside out and he just had it in his mind that was the next shot he was going to play. Uh, I thought it was a good shot selection. Just it's a difficult one to play. Rafa does them. We saw how many times he did that same shot and it worked for him. Yeah. Break point um, number three. Here we go. Oh, something going on his eyes then, wasn't there? Yeah, like I think he told Tim to stop. A bit of clay flying up into the eyes, blowing the wind, blowing it into nice his eyes. Nice sportsman's uh, behaviour there from Tim, waiting yeah. for him. Should have done a quick underarm serve. That's why. Given the point, he felt sorry for uh, it. <laughs> suddenly, Grigor Dimitrov's on the court. Got the eye <laughs> eye infection, or what was it? Oh, no, it was two. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't his eye. It right. could have been his eyes, mate. It didn't look like he was watching. <laughs> I don't think he didn't like he could like, see much. He couldn't see where the net was, I don't think. <laughs> it's in the, into the bottom of it. Michael's asking, did I survive the Nadal match? Just about. Just about. I was uh, just. very nervous. I thought Shapovalov was incredible. Um, it was one of the best matches I've I've watched for a while. Shame we couldn't do it on the live watch-alongs. Uh, but I'm just really happy Nadal's into the next round. It was an epic can Dominic team get past Lorenzo Sonego to give himself a chance of winning this tournament? The slice from Sonego team puts away the volley. It's advantage Dominic team. We've got a Bassa joining us. How we doing, mate? Hey, the regular Twitcher. The only Twitcher. Yeah. <laughs> no, I think there's no, there might be one other. <laughs> Is there? <laughs> I think so. And we got some Bamos Rafa. Team serving. Advantage. He's saved three break points in this game so far. Big serve down the tee. It's good return from Sonego. He's hammered it down the line and it's a big shank off the racket and it's gone wide. Cute. Big game of faces coming up there for a second. What are you man. doing? Like my finger slipped on the pad and it just went whoop all the way down. And I hit, I'd already clicked it and it started playing. No, it wasn't even a shank. Yeah, mate, that, that wasn't a shank. Are you no, joking? That's not a shank, it went... When it's forced, when it's forced, you can't give the shank. I think we need to understand like it, it, your it, shank, it... you're very uh, uh opt you like giving shanks about. Mate, it came off his frame. That's a shank. Mm, okay, I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. Shank I don't though. like I don't like it when you give shanks for someone where they're stretching and then it's not really a shank for me. I'd re let's rewind it. Let's see it again. <laughs> we can't, unfortunately. Uh, well, we got Pizan to... saying Dommy. Very excited with that one. He did very well there. 20 minutes played and we're only had five games, but team's been showing a lot of resilience to fight off uh, the hungry Italian. Yeah, definitely agree. I think it's going to be a matter of how can you, how long can you hold him off, really? Yeah. Because I think Sonego, how much fight does he have in him to, tonight? Dominic Team's the type of player that can drain your gas tank a little bit. He can keep you in the match until you're not in the match, like Fuchskovic had. He hung in there, and then 
I think team outlasts a lot of players. Saw it with Kyrgios at the Australian yeah. Open. Couldn't get it over the line in five. Team did the big comeback. He has it in the locker. That's why everyone compares him a little bit to Rafa in that respect. There's always a chance that Dominic team can come back. <coughs> and tie breaks, he's probably one of the best players in the world. Oh, yeah. Amazing. With Djokovic. Like, he's so good in tie breaks, Dominic team. Remember him in the ATP finals against Rafa? I think there's just so many I can allude to, to be fair. He doesn't seem to lose in, in tie breaks, team. He's won a few recently as well. Indeed. Just uh, long on the serve there from Sonego. The crowd a little bit quieter at the moment. You can still hear a few people uh, talking. The, in the Opelka match earlier, people wouldn't turn their phones off. They kept on going off all the time. Ridiculous. Uh, into the net there. Yeah. It's love 15. Yeah, how do you how do you police a whole crowd of people that all have mobile phones? Though? I saw one guy who was just on the phone. In it's the just stands. common. You just need to have common decency. If you're going into yeah. a tennis tournament, just put your phone on silent at least. I'm not that against people using their phones. It's just put it on silent. Yeah. I got uh, ex Hypno saying uh, the crowd was electric during the Berrettini match until Steph pulled the plug. I agree. Yeah. Watched that one earlier. I think Steph looked really good, though. Berrettini was running out of steam for me. I think. Yeah. He's so totally Djokovic. So I think it's going to be a great match. Hopefully, we can cover that. I believe it'll be, is it tomorrow? Steph, uh, City past Djokovic. Going to be going to have Again. to wait to see what time the uh, what time the match is on. I'm hoping it's not a morning one. Uh, that's yeah, what yeah. I'm really hoping. Oh no, apparently it's twelve twelve thirty. So it might be a lunchtime job. Might might be lucky. Yeah, Ooh. might be worth trying to cover it. Snago down the line across oh, court, oh, down the line oh, from team winner. One of the best points. Really good from both players. Team finds the angle and big powerful forehand. Fifteen thirty now. You got Nishikori in the other match taking. Uh, Zverev to town right now. He's free love up wow. in the final step. Amazing. I told Nishikura. you, mate. Nishikori is back. Zverev may be a bit tired after last week winning in Madrid. Nishikori is not the player you want to be playing if you're tired. He's got <laughs> legs for days. Yeah. Sonego serving wide. Oh, nearly hit that line judge in the face with that <laughs> serve. He's ducked out of the way just in The camera's time. just zooming into him just to make sure he's all right. <laughs> Matrix. <laughs> I think he was in the Matrix, that guy. Well, Dominic team. Good return inside that forehand. He's opened the court out. He's still going inside that forehand. Sonego down the line. Oh, backhand's too good. What a shot. And poor decision from team. Why did he go back the same way? He had the whole court to hit into. But that precision from Sonego, he was forced wide onto yep. the backhand side and he picks a backhand on the line. And yeah, team physically good. can't get there. Really well. That's world class. Brilliant shot. Strange decision making from uh It's Dominic team's team. fault though, really allowed him to have that shot. He should have played it into the open court. And then most likely you'd have two break points now. Well. Oh, let for service. It's a game of fine decisions and fine margins. This one. And team there's made the wrong one. <laughs> Indeed, mate. Lorenzo Sonego has another first serve here. He's just blowing on his hands just to dry them a little bit, just to hope he can get a good connection on this serve. He needs a good first serve right now. Team right on the backboards Ooh. there. Returns it well. Oh, he's slipped a little bit there, Dominic Team. They're going forehand for forehand. Team goes down the line. Lorenzo Sonego backhand. Team's big backhand looping up. Opens the court up. Goes forehand into Sonego's forehand. Goes down the line. Sonego's backhand cross court. Team went for his backhand. Didn't Good work. Good rally. Good rally into between the them two. Enjoyed that. Got Debanga joining us. How are you doing, mate? Good to have you in. Good to see you, mate. I just want to say to everyone who has who is joining us and who has joined us from the start, please, if you haven't already, give us a like on this video. It really helps out with the YouTube algorithm. Um, and if you haven't already and you want to, hit the subscribe button. We're going to be doing more live watch-alongs. We've got some big ones tomorrow and then the weekend as well. We'll be covering the finals and semi-finals. Indeed. Well, we've seen a lot of strange ball tosses earlier on today. Uh, El Chapo, he yeah. tends to throw it up about four or five times. Uh, he's turning into Sarah Arani. <laughs> but we can't diss El Chapo because his serving was actually really good. It was Some the... ace serving from him. Wow, oh, big winner. Come on, showing his class from the Italian. 
And, uh, mate, I think that's button worthy. He's played some good shots there, and we need to get the Italian button going. Uh, <laughs> oh, and now there's a well, they're all clapping in unison. They're willing Sonego on to beat Dominic team right now. And uh, yeah, Capel saying uh, Sonego looks more comfortable, well, more comfortable today on the court. I think he does, he, he looks at home there. Oh, so, three all team serving three all. Second serve coming up into the... Well, it's just gone down the line there. Sonego, big forehand winner. Fantastic. Come on, man. I can, I can, I can feel it. He can do this. You've got Shavam saying, Sonego is a very talented player. I wish he wasn't so unsportsmanlike. If he changes his attitude, he will become one of my favourite players. Interesting. I don't really recall too much unsportsmanlike behaviour from him. He's still young. He's a young guy, 33 in the world. He's only getting better and better. And on the clay courts, this is his time. In Rome, I think he's got a good chance here if he beats team. Of having Indeed. a nice little run. Who will, they, who will they be playing next in the next round? What, these players? Yep. Well, they're going to be up against Andre Rublev or Batista Agut, who are playing uh, later on tonight. It's just long there from Sonego. Oh, and the crowd's got, oh, and now everyone's questioning whether that was out or not. What's happened? Was it not out? I think, I think they're going to replay the point. Uh, that was the one thing that really bugged me earlier. You can't have these bad calls when you're playing Riley Opelka. You, Karatsev got into the rally. It's so hard to get into a rally with Riley Opelka, and his shots were going in. Someone called them out, and Riley Opelka gets a first serve again, which is ridiculous to me. Oh! So they go on the run. Big forehand. And he taps Finishes it away. It. Come on, Love 30 deserved that. And I've said this and I'll say it again. An Italian on the run is a dangerous player. Sanego does it. Massetti does it. Sinner does it. If you put them on the run and they've got a running forehand or a backhand yeah. or something, they're so good. I don't know how they're so good, but they are. The crowd really getting into this matchup right now. Got, uh, Manoj there saying he's from India. How are we doing, mate? And he's saying, please tell me the winner. I'm going Sonego. Ben's going for team. So that probably doesn't help you. <laughs> oh, wild there from Sonego. Just needed to rein it in a little bit for me. Didn't need to go so big. He could have just disguised a drop shot maybe there. You had got Sverev had four break points in the other in, in the other match to get back on serve and he's lost all of them. Oh, dear. It's not over until it's over, though. Still only 3-1, soon to be 4-1, potentially. And it is 4-1. Big serve from team. Out wide. He's opened the court up. Big forehand yeah, winner from shot. Dominic team. The one-two he's so good at. He needs to do more of them. Serve out wide, then forehand down the line. I'm glad to see Dominic team hitting the ball a, a lot better. Yeah. So that's that's one promising sign for me this week. I think Dominic team's been lackluster. I was worried he'd be lackluster after the first set against Vukovic. He looks out of sorts. That serve looked good to me. It, it looked it? good to me as well. I'll be honest. <laughs> must have just been long. Yeah, oh, my eyesight must be going. Second yeah. serve. It's gone. It's that's double long. ball, and that's it's great point. Yeah, break point Sonego. Another one. He's gifting him that one gifting him a break point let us know in the live chat what's your score predictions for this matchup do you have Sonego the home countryman winning this match or do you think Dominic team gonna do the comeback like I'm predicting good serve he steps in drive volley Sonego into the net so close. clips the top of the net team was in no man's land if Sonego could have got that back I think he was in um Team was in a spot above, spot above her there. Yeah, I think Juice. Dominic Team being taken to juice a lot of times right now on his serve. Break point saved four by Dominic Team so far, zero from Lorenzo Sonego. That gives you an idea of the pressure Sonego's putting on Dominic Team's serve right now. 
Good serve. Good return from Don, uh, from Sonego. Goes inside out forehand. Sonego's backhand into team's backhand. It's Come long. It's going to be another break point. The crowd like that one. He's threatening, isn't he? Sonego is looking good. And we've got Anchor saying Karatsev have disappointed today. I just don't think there was much all you of could us, do. Anka, all of us. It's so sad. I really wanted him to beat. How much you could have done? He tried. He got the set point. He didn't manage to take it. And mate, Apelka so far he's defeated Massetti and Karatsev. He's taken all of our favourites out, mate. Mate, I hate it. I hate to see it. Maybe you can Apelka have to become the new favourite. Great, <gasps> great shot there from Sonego. He's got it back in. It's Come nice. On! Oh, there we go. He breaks. What a break. There you go. Finally, he does it. The Italian leads now in this match. He's got the break. It's in his hand. Can we go for a 6-4? That's what I'm expecting, mate. 6-4. Come on. Hold your serve, and then you can get a 6-4 here. Wait and see. <laughs> Will he be able to consolidate the break? You know on GTL, it is not a break unless you consolidate. Do you think, let us know in the live chat, do you think Lorenzo Sonego can serve to consolidate that break? Be interesting to see how you guys think he's going to handle the pressure. He seems to be handling it and thriving at the moment with the amount of pressure he has in this matchup. He has the potential, if he wins this matchup, to go through to face the winner of Batista Rublev. And if he beats Dominic Team, why can't he beat either of those guys? I think he has a great serve. I think he has great power. I think he's good off both wings as well. His backhand and his forehand are very solid. Maybe his net play, I, I haven't seen much of him at the net, but I, I think he's got, he's got the whole package. He just needs to put it together and be more consistent. I think consistency is the key as it is with most tennis players. That's what separates the best players in the world from the rest, just consistency. That's why you see players like Djokovic, Nadal, and Federer at the top of the game, because they're just consistent. If Sonego can put it together on a regular basis, he could be cracking the top 20, maybe even the top 10 if he was to put it together. You saw him defeat Djokovic in impressive fashion, and that was uh, in the back end of last year. He mate, can the do Italians, it. Have the Italians not got enough talent already? I know, I'm loving mate. it, though, to be fair. It's brilliant that I'm half Italian because oh, I can claim them. Oh, dodgy the, top shot. The Italian tennis players right now are just insane. There's so many good ones. Anchor saying the day of upsets. Well, I don't know if Rafa winning was an upset. <laughs> he nearly Djokovic got upset. winning wasn't really an upset. Nah, I don't think so. I don't even think Opelka winning was an upset, really, because I think he just can do that to people. I think if it was someone like Djokovic, he would have struggled, Opelka. But... Maybe Sverev going out, upset. Could say that well, one, probably. Could go out. Could potentially go out. Yeah, he's not out yet, too. though, so it's hard to say. It's... Business end still yet to come for Nishikori. He's still got to try and, once he gets to that magic five... Yeah, it's a lot of work he's got body, to be doing, yeah. The body We've got Batista Agut soon. Batista Agut Rublev. Fancy that one going. I remember it from Monte Carlo. It was could have been anybody's match. There's part yeah. of me that when I saw it, I thought Batista Agut wins it. Oh, it's wide from Sonego. He went for it. He was right to go for it. It was open. The court. He missed it, though. And 15-30 and team with a small window of opportunity now to get back into this matchup. Can he do it? There's a lot of people saying Sonego comes across very arrogant. I've seen it in the live chat. I've seen it on Twitter as well. What think do you think about that? He just give off a bit of an arrogant vibe. I, think it's I must just admit, Italian, like God, it's just that sort of vibe, though, isn't it? Yeah. And there's an ace. Yeah, but if you compare him to say a Yannick Sinner, Sinner doesn't give off the arrogance, does he? Sinner's a ginger Italian. It's slightly different. He's more traditional Italian. He's the dark-haired Italian. I think he has a bit more of the Italian football player. I bet he was a footballer back in his day, probably. I can see him as a footballer. Like an Inzaghi or someone like that. <laughs> That's what reminds me of that. Good serving again. 
40 30. You've got midfield Maestro and Sinner's a bit like Seppi. Yeah, I think so. I think that's a fair comparison. I think <laughs> Seppi is <laughs> understated. He doesn't really, he doesn't really attack. I don't know. I'm not laughing at that. He got magged here. Yeah. Hey, hey, guys, sorry I'm late. I was fucking <laughs> in my dishwasher. We always Thanks get some it. weird uh, reasons why people are late. What was some, some of the other day? Oh, I'm late. I was painting my dishwasher. I think it was, the same. My... I think it was Magdi. Was it Magdi? Yeah. What? Keep doing them. I enjoy them. Thanks I think for it was us, washing Magdi. machine last time. Yeah. <laughs> Vacuum. Because Sonia said, "Are we going to ignore it? We're not going to ignore it. We had to bring it up, and uh, <laughs> I love it." Let us know why you what, what you've just been doing just before you've joined us on the live watch. Oh, that's a new one. Yeah, I like to hear about that. Keep it PG though, please, guys. <laughs> no, no, no craziness. Dominic team serving to stay in the first set. Yeah, and it's with five... that, mate, we forgot something. Sanego consolidates the break. He does. <laughs> Wow, he's giving Sonego the run around and it finally goes long. You see the difference in when it goes longer than, I say, six or seven shots, Dominic team takes over the rallies. These short rallies, Sonego blasting him off the court. Yeah. Dominic, it's a good match, though. I'm enjoying it I so know, far. I'm, I think I'm not sure what's going to happen next kind of thing. Team's not out of this yet. It's Ooh. quality. Oh, can he get the putt? Oh, he's on the well run, played. mate. I thought that was really the staple. Really well played. Yeah, that is the staple, but I think he didn't have enough time to get there. No, he didn't. <laughs> it was a good shot from team. We've got two more break points for Zverev as well. Nishikori struggling physically right now, apparently, according to Abasa. Martin saying, I'm doing online school while watching you guys and the game. <laughs> Brilliant well, stuff. Proper multitasking there. I like Three things that. going on. Andrea saying, I'm kind of confused by the flags behind you. What, an Austrian one and an Italian one? That's the two nationalities of the players. Come on. I think Andrea's saying, are we at Austrian and Italian? Well, guess oh. what? We kind of are as well. Ben's got some heritage in Austria. I've got some heritage in Italy. But exactly. we're both British, really. Yeah, exactly. My grandmother. And Sverev yeah. breaks. Sverev is back. We can announce oh, wow. him the other He is back indeed. Oh, great serve there, team. Comes in for the smash and he makes it 40-15 now. He's going to make Sanego here. Potentially serve this one out for the first set. But he still needs one more point. Under pressure. <laughs> well, I can announce Muguruza out as well. Svitolina went through 6-2 in the final set. Fairly comfortably in the end. Good for That's my bracket, what... isn't it? Yeah, annoyingly it is. Anno I think my bracket's dead in the women's row, <laughs> unfortunately. No, you've still was... got the winner in. I've got Hallop and she pulled out, which is annoying. I think the only person below me is I obviously know my tennis. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm going to say Nishikori's drained. Oh, that's not a good sign. Oh, it's long and Dominic team holds and Lorenzo Sonego will have to serve it out for the first set. How are Ooh. your nerves? Sounds like a drum kit or something you got going on there. <laughs> it's probably better than your drum roll. <laughs> <That's what> <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Sounds like just all snare though. There's no uh, nothing else to going on there. Well, maybe you can just add the little <laughs> to it then. Do it together. Mine's <laughs> more of a deeper, deeper sound. Mate, at this Mate. rate, a good and Rublev are going to be playing about eight o'clock in another hour's time. Because uh, Zverev's back on serve. If that one goes to a tie break, it could have another half an hour in it. 40 minutes. Could well do indeed. Lorenzo Sonego, hope, he'll hope to be done and dusted by then. Finish the first set. Cream him in the second set. Dominic team has other ideas, I'm sure. Maybe it's the Huskies, says <laughs> Midfield Maestro. <laughs> Might have been. <laughs> can he do it, Sonego? I hope he can. <laughs> Are we disappointed? I think he deserves it. He's been playing well. But Magdi said, I love how Sonia knows I'm a girl. <laughs> this is my father's email. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Now is that just from vacuum in the uh, dishwasher? The Vanguard, are you guys from London or any other cities? Yeah, pretty yeah, much. You're both from, from London. London. Yeah, bruv. <laughs> <laughs> They don't talk like that in London, don't they? No, they don't talk like that. I'm <laughs> Sorry, <sorry>. Ben. <laughs> Living there, not from there. 
from Kent, <laughs> from the Garden of England in the southeast. Not so much the garden these days. There's been a couple, few murders <laughs> floating around in Kent these days. Too much woodland in that in those areas and in Essex as well. Yeah, a few bodies get jumped dumped there usually. Ah, oh, disgraceful Epping Forest. Sonego serving for the first set anyway. Just a long clip the net cord. Second serve. Can he hold his nerve on the serve? Team responds, good depth on the return. Goes inside out forehand, Sonego backhand. Inside out forehand, Sonego backhand down the line. It, not much sting on it. Sonego steps in, team backhand Ooh. into the net. Single-handed's not good. Big point. I'm not impressed by team single-handed backhand today at all. It still hasn't come to life yet this year. I'm yeah. waiting to see it. Where is Dominic Team's backhand? Maybe we'll put our poster up. And also, Ben, something we've not spoken about, but it's Eid, isn't it? So Eid Mubarak to all of our uh, followers who, who are celebrating. Indeed. It's Eid. Hope you're having a great day. <laughs> Some good English slang there from Mid from Russia. Hey, bruv, what's man doing? It looks leng, bruv. <laughs> nice uh, bit of English slang, apparently. That's good. Anyway, back to the match. Forehand for forehand. Team loops it into the Snago backhand. Team goes into the Snago forehand, playing it down the middle. Team goes for the winner. Oh, he's dug Snago's... it out almost. Uh, the problem is it was too passive there, too Snago. Good. He allowed Team into the point too much. He should have forced him out wide. He picked one in, in no man's land and gave Team a free shot at it. I don't want to see that from him. Play Fantastic more confident. Angles. Fantastic angles there from Dominic team. Yeah, was able. lack of confidence from Sonego though. Come on, that was a bad sign to be doing that when you're serving out for a set. Percentage tennis. That's what happens when you get into this squeaky bum time of the business end, really. I think this is pretty much is it. Do you Definitely think it's business is. end? Oh, let's see. If, if team wins this point, I'll give it to you. All right. Oh, based yeah. off that first serve, <laughs> hit the bottom of the net like a table tennis shot. That is definitely business end. <laughs> Dominic team returns it, loops it up, a bit of a moon ball. Snago backhand to team's forehand. Snago only hitting around the service line at the moment, afraid to go for the power. Dominic team, is he going to go for the power? Snago just oh. over the net. She goes cross court. Net, that one. Yeah, slice from team. Good depth on the slice. He's gone into the Snago backhand. Snago, oh. great angle on the backhand. Now he steps in. Oh, oh, it's, oh it's a shank. It is a bit of a shank, yeah. Definitely a shank. The oh, crowd, this is my biggest on his fear. Back. The crowd's trying to get Sonego up for it. It's 15 30, on 20 his shot rally. He's close to serving it out, but he's just not getting it over the line right now. You got Sverev in the other match, uh, four apiece, mate. And he's looking to break again at 15 30 in the other yeah. match. Sverev on the war path right now. The German looking to go through to the next round. Come on, big serve needed here. Needs to get a first serve. He does. He's found one. Really good go. serve. Come on. 30 all. Two points away now. Wow. This is clutch tennis. Big serve was needed. Big serve was found. And can he get another one in this? Oh, it's a tenser one, mate. He I don't know to. if he's he going to be able to get say, it. Big thanks to everyone who's joining us for this one from Italy and for all over the world. If you haven't already, please leave us a like on this video and hit the subscribe button. Is Sonego going to find his first serve? He, he does. does. Big one. Oh, no, he nice don't. No. <laughs> he does. We both He doesn't. He <laughs> <laughs> Looked very close. I thought it was in. I didn't hear anyone call out. And maybe it was so far out they didn't even bother. Second serves in. Dominic team returns. Sonego forehand. Team forehand. He runs round his backhand. His team slice cross court. Sonego oh, into the net. We got a great point for Dominic the, team. The slice was too good. The it was slice so good. was really too good. So good there from Dominic team. Sonego running around his backhand. He backpedaled about three meters to get onto his forehand there. 
Scared to hit that backhand. And with that, Sverev breaks. He's now serving for the match against Nishikori. That's crazy. To face Rafael Nadal. Serving again. it out again. Well, to face Rafa. Good return from team. It's good length. He's whipped into court. Team goes down the line. Great body, oh, Sonego. Really good tennis. That is such good tennis facing break point. Great, sir. The audacity to try that. I thought he could have done a little bit better with the other one. He looped it. I mean, allowed team to get into it, but the, c- coming to the net was a really good shot. Good yeah, idea. Definitely. Good volley. Played yeah, it into difficult the volley goal. to play, but perfect execution. We've got Antonio from Italy saying, Forza Sanego. Come on. Two, Two points. points away. Yeah, definitely again, mate. Two points away again. Deuce. It's wide on the first serve. He's going to have a second serve to look at here, Dominic team. Where is he going to place it? They've been a little bit passive, the second serves. Oh, he's messed up the ball toss. The, the nerves getting to him at the moment. The nerves on the serves. Second serve coming. The bounce in the ball. Throws it up. He goes down the tee. Dominic team loops up the return. Dominic team on the stretch into the forehand side. Sonego's looped up his return as well. Need the player hitting it with any conviction at the moment. Good slice from Dominic team. Forehand from Sonego. Now backhand down the line from Sonego. Team steps in with a massive oh. ball. It's in play. Now he's kept in with a slice. Sonego's into the net. Team with the oh. volley into the net. Oh, what, a point. Point. what a point. The crowd's on their feet. That was brilliant from Sonego. But team, incredible. what a shot. What an angle. How did he find the angle? And how did Sonego get it back? Rally of the match. Yeah, really good point. Fantastic from Sonego there to chop that back into play. And that one especially, fantastic play. Lorenzo yeah, and he Sinego. deserves it. Set point now. Incredible. Want to say thanks, everybody, for joining us for this. The last Italian stand-in. Can he do it? Hit the like button on the video. If you are new to the channel, hit the subscribe button too. Oh, the crowd thought it was in. It was full. No, it is. Oh, it's, it's in. in. There we go. Sonego takes the first set. I can't believe it. What a, what a performance, mate. I wasn't sure if it was in myself. It's I think it. they called it was out. Yeah, they went, huh? <laughs> but anyway, regardless of that, Sonego takes the first set. I thought it was someone in the crowd, maybe, that screamed just to celebrate, possibly. Yeah, and we've Not... got, let's, let's go to the other match, because there's a lot going on there. Zverev, 30-15 up. He's two points yeah. away. Now he is 40-15. He's got two match points, Zverev, to face Rafael Nadal again. Is he going to beat him twice? Well, it's going to be tough. It's going to be tired. In that first set, though, Dominic team, only six winners. Lorenzo Sonego, 13 yeah. Only four unforced errors from team and nine from Sonego, but it's high risk tennis. Sonego's first... been the better player, I'll be honest. Yeah. His first serve speed 202 kilometers an hour compared to 181 of his team. Um, I think overall the stats are telling the story a little bit, but Sonego just looks slightly more um aggressive, a bit more consistent. He seems to be a lot more comfortable, a little bit more pumped, and team's more in his head. He seems a bit more of a frustrated figure on court. Definitely. I think Dominic Team hasn't looked his real self for quite some time. I'm hoping he can rediscover it in the next set. And hopefully he has more bottle than Lorenzo Sonego to win this next set. Yeah, crowd... and I apologize, guys, with the buttons. We agree. We definitely need to update the Italian buttons. Um, they are very <laughs> basic at the moment, but we will do some special buttons for the players. It's more of a time thing right now. We've not had much time Definitely. to update them all. He didn't even have a button at 10 minutes before the match, so at least he has a button. <laughs> <laughs> I just had to throw one on quickly. The Sinner button, exactly. Well, these players' buttons get upgraded the better they do in tournaments. So if Sonego gets to the final of this tournament... He will have a much better button. That is guaranteed. That thing gives me nightmares. <laughs> the Sinner one is possibly my favorite button, I think. <laughs> the Dominic Team one is terrible as well, though, to be honest. He hasn't. There we go. Sverev's done it. 
Sverev has done it. So we're going to be seeing Incredible. Sverev versus Nadal. He turned it around from 4 Incredible. 2 down. He made it, well, he won four games on the bounce and won 6 4. Quickly as well. It wasn't yeah. even a, a slow. He just seemed to suddenly turn it on and Nishikuri ran out of steam there. Well, Rublev and Agut will be happy. They will. They, they'll, they be get going to play. <laughs> on, they'll be going on court very soon. I think 20 minutes time, we'll see Rublev and Agut on court as well. But um, what do you think about this second set coming up for Team Senego? Well, it's going the way I sort of said it would before the match. It's just the question is, does it go the way that you predicted or does it go the way that I predicted? You went Senego in two sets. I said team to lose the first set and win in three. Let's see if the, either of our guys can do it. Well, either of us could be right as well here. Yeah. They could. One of us is going to be right for a change, which mm, is pretty not amazing. Necessarily, team could win it, and then he could lose in three. Oh yeah, <laughs> so, that's the only scenario. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> probably that's going to happen then. <laughs> awesome. Most probably. Well, Dominic team, fifteen love, it's off to a good start. The crowd have quietened down a little bit now after the, quite an exciting end to that first set. Has to be said. Yeah, I thought it was a good one team going into the Sonego backhand he's slicing it not running round it this time slicing it back in team inside out Ooh. forehand into Sonego's backhand it's long or wide sorry from Sonego oh, I really want Sonego to break early I think that'll be big for him both players seem to be running around their backhands a lot today though which is a bit of a surprise I'm, I know Sonego was hitting the ball really well off his back end the first set. I'm not sure why he suddenly decided to start running around it so much. And Dominic Teams hasn't been good for quite some time, though. I can sort of see why he's doing it. He's not confident on his at all, especially on the topspin one. The slice is fine. Topspin, not there at all. He's not even testing it, which is the worrying thing. He's that... Um, well, he's so unconfident in his back end topspin at the moment that he won't hit the down-the-line uh, backhand. That's the shot, mate. That's the one we want to see. We want to yeah. see him blitz it. But, but like I was saying to you, mate, this is why I was so surprised you picked team to win the bracket. He's not looked great. Against uh, Zverev as well, in Madrid, he wasn't particularly that good. Um, I'm I surprised a, you have so much faith in him when I've I not seen anything in that, that good from him. I went for a risk just based upon if team suddenly comes back to form, he could easily win this, win this tournament, considering the way that Rafa's oh, been playing. What a as slice! Well. Yeah, what a slice that is from Sonego. Yeah, really good. He's showing how good he is today. I think people who haven't watched him much, probably me as well included. I've, I've obviously I've watched him many times, but not as much as other players on tour. And it's really refreshing to see a young player play with so much confidence. And some of the shots he can make are really top draw. There's not many players who who make the shots he does. His defense is very good. And he can find crazy angles that aren't necessarily there. Oh, he's a very good player. I mean... Team ace. And he's on the board. One love. Good start uh, for him in the second set. Come on, Dominic. Or Dommy. I know he likes to be called Dommy, doesn't he? Lorenzo <laughs> I don't know if he Snake... likes it. It's just other people call him Dommy. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think he calls himself it. But, Does he? Uh, How do you yeah. know that? You spoke to team then. He was like, oh, I yeah, I'm called I Dommy. He signs stuff, signs, stuff, uh, signs stuff off on social media as Dommy. What, has he so, been sending you signed T-shirts then? No, nah, just when I chat to him, he's always writing dummy. I don't know why. <laughs> but Lorenzo Sonego is up to 30 in the world. He was 33 before the tournament. Uh, he can move up if he wins this match here today. I believe he will move up another place. He'll overtake Borna Chorich. If he was to go through maybe once more, he'd probably overtake... I believe Fabio Fanini as well. He could Ooh. be getting close to Dan Evans up there in 27th. Then. Yeah, I think it's nice to see Sonego taking the reins off Fanini. Similar kind of players. I think Sonego is his moment now in the sun. Fanini's had his time. Um, hopefully, he isn't turned like Fanini with his attitude, but he's got the ability to. Do you know what I mean? And we've got yep. Thomas Rock joining us. How are we doing, mate? Hey, uh, how you doing, buddy? Super sicker. Cheers, buddy. Yeah, if you guys want the chance to try and get onto the top tippers, all you got to do is uh, send us a super chat or send us a donation through the link in the description and it will be added. It just has to be over $5 because you can see fifth place is Vanch with five. You just have to get over that and you'll get onto the top tippers leaderboard for May. 
So Dominic team is one point the good on the Lorenzo Sonego serve right now. Lorenzo Mate, Sonego. Listen to some of these matchups quickly, Ben. Matthew de Souza and Sfera of Nadal and Novak Steph. Oof. We're in for Mate. some big ones this tournament now. I hope that we could cover both of them. And they're not mate. finals. <laughs> mate, might have to reschedule some meetings. Well, oh, Rafa and Nadal, Rafa and Nadal, Rafa and Nadal, they're not playing each other. <laughs> Nadal and Zverev. I think but... Rafa wins. Oh, great drop shot there from Sonego. I'm not sure if he dug that out or not. It looked I like think he did bounce. and team gave up. But, I don't like that from a player when they completely give up. Just try and run back. <laughs> there was no point. It was the whole court was open. He was so out of position. Oh, wow. Look at Pizan. He just sent $420. <laughs> Going straight to the top. Love that. Thank you. Uh, Zverev, Nadal, 11 o'clock tomorrow. Just, oh, really? That's what it's it's already been put in? Yep. Djokovic Maybe it's Sitab not official, though. Djokovic, Sitabas, half past 12. Okay. Interesting. That's a shame, mate. Shame we don't have the afternoon off. Um, I so might be able to wangle it. I'm, I'll have to try have to have. Oh, what a drop shot there from Dominic team. Didn't even bother running for that one. Yeah, well, Barty Goff was another one I wanted to do as well, mate. <laughs> that's another epic matchup tomorrow. Unfortunately, that's on the same time as Djokovic versus Sitipas at 12.30. Svontek, Svitolina, another amazing matchup there. Yeah. And there yeah. Are, the banger's asking what's our prediction for Barty Goff. Ben's Barty. got Barty to win the whole thing. Yeah, and I can yeah. kind of see it, but I'm going for Corey Goff because I want Ben to lose the bracket and give me a chance of uh, winning. Mate, I don't think I've got and a chance. I love Corey Goff as well. Ben would tell you I'm always picking her. I don't think I've got a chance, mate, in the bracket at all. I think even if... I think Svitolina, but pays it. Oh! oh I think he doesn't make team. it. He's so close. Wide. Fractionally wide. Team screams out and he was this close probably to a few break points. <laughs> Midfield was saying, just, just watch Nadal's Zverev. Don't worry, guys. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I really, it's a tough one for tomorrow. To be fair, because obviously we've got work as well. I don't know how. I oh, can't really take the whole day off, can we? No, I don't think it's possible. Especially it's a bit late now. It's that short notice. A good serve, good chop back into play. He's gone with a winner. Sonego hits the winner, and it is forty thirty. No break points yet for Dominic team in this game. Tabango's right. Yeah, it was an excellent drop shot from team, but he's getting pegged back and it's 40 30. And Birmingham Savage saying, Is team going to pull this off? I hope not. I hope he is. <laughs> I'm going for the for the Italian stallion, Lorenzo Sonego. Good return from team. Goes with a drop shot. Team's in. He gets it back into play. Sonego's too yeah, good. Come on, on, good drop shot. Brought him in, pulled him out wide. And that's all he needed to do. One all now in this second set. Obviously, Sonego, if you're just joining us, he took the first set, 6-4. Really good first set. Quite evenly contested, but Sonego was definitely the better player and deserved the first set. Yeah, definitely. Dominic team had spells, but the crowd really getting behind Lorenzo Sonego here today. Really helping him on his way to victory, potentially. Very heavy underdog as well here today. Nearly three to one. Dominic team inside that forehand into the Sonego backhand. Sliced back into play. Now going into the forehand side. Sonego oh, on the run. On the run. I told you, Ben. He's gone with he's the drop still shot. running. He's, oh, it's a great oh. shot. Oh, it's long, I think. It's going to be big. Claiming. Team's challenging, but I'm not sure, mate. That's not long for me. I don't know. I think it is, mate. No, I think that was in. I think that's harsh. Nah. What do you no, mean you think it's that's harsh? a lot of rubbish. It, it, that was in. It that in. was in. I'm not it buying just, it. It floated. That was why you thought it was in. It just floated there with the slice. Oh, oh well, it's, they're saying it's out. This is where the Hawkeye shows it was in. <laughs> they're not no, even going to show it on the Hawkeye. They're scared, Ben. I told you it was in. <laughs> Regardless, 15 love Dominic team. Out. Into the net. A poor Ooh, serve there from the team. Terrible serve. Dominic team with the whole weight of the world on his shoulders, it seems, right now. That's how he looks when I look at him. His facial expressions show that. Good return there from Sonego. He's peppering Sonego's backhand right now. Sonego, big oh, winner down the line. Come on, Lorenzo, Lorenzo, 15-0. That's the backhand I said. He 
stop being so passive. He's got it in his locker. Yeah, but he's good when um, if team puts a lot of pace on the ball towards his backhand, he can just redirect it down the line. That's exactly what he did there. He's Great good at shot. doing that. Very good player. 18 and you can winners. see 18 winners compared to teams eight. Wow. He's completely obliterating him on the winner count. Yeah, Dominic team. He's going to have to do the hang in there again game like he did. Oh, oh what a great shot from Snego. Chopped somehow back into play by team. Amazing recovery. Now another one. Oh, oh wow. Dominic team. Fantastic recoverability there in that rally. Have to take your hat off to Dominic team there. Go on then. All right. <laughs> no, put it back on. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I don't want to scare people away from the stream. <laughs> trying to do. So, Dominic team, 30-15. To the good. Good serve out to the Senego backhand. Oh, it's into oh, the net. There's not many return. cheap points from serves, is there? Only on the Senego's side. Yeah, it's good. I like that. We've seen a lot of rallies, some good points. Uh, both defending very well. I think this Team is an epic match. High quality clay court of hair, this one. Swartzman's probably watching at home loving it. Yeah, definitely. Rafa's probably in an ice bath somewhere watching it. Yeah, the Rafa's, the Swartzman's of these world. They're probably just sitting there watching this, thinking, what a clay oh, court battle. I wish start. I was out there. Jinxed it, mate. I said no three points off the team serve, and he gets the one. Nice one, team. Finally they mind get... games, didn't you, with him? I think so. <laughs> Peace out, Sam. Just wonder how the umpire makes it through the whole match without needing the load. <laughs> Especially the Rafa Shafo one. Yeah, but Maybe do they just... drink? Do they have water? I've like, never seen them really drink. They them must just have to be very, very conservative with uh, what they drink. Great return there, but great forehand from team. Yeah, That's holds. what we want to see. A tough Big hold. hold. Tough hold. But he did it. Yeah, yeah really I've always good. wondered that as well. Those umpires, they sit up there for some of those matches. I think the Grand Slam finals where they go five hours. Yeah. <laughs> the umpire doesn't move, do they? Well, you got uh, Sonia saying they wear diapers. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I wonder what the smell was when I've been there. Got a catheter, maybe. Got a little, got a little bag attached to... That's uh, what Ben does. He's got a diaper. He didn't want to leak the stream. That's it, mate. I've just got a bucket next to the desk. <laughs> <laughs> that's just disgusting <laughs> right, just empty it at the end of the stream but well Dominic team held he's on to two games to one now it's a good sign holding your serve isn't easy here tonight and uh, the, the floodlights are on it's the site we wanted to see in Rome we're finally getting to see it the evening match with the Italian the crowd are up for it. There's a lot of rumblings in the crowd at the moment in the changeover. It looks like quite a lot of people there. People yeah. excited to see if Sonego can cause the upset here today. It's so our only hope tomorrow, mate, is if the Del Bonis and the Apelka goes on for a very long time. If that match is like three hours, we can cover more like all of it. But if there's it's no not, chance that's three hours. There's no right? chance of Pelka's match is going to be three hours. So unfortunately, we're probably going to have to miss out on the Dal Sverev. Mate, we might have to try and find a way. We'll have to try and find a way. Yeah, we'll have to see how it goes. There must be a way. We will try our best anyway. We will work out the schedules. I know I've we got just need night. we need Del Bonis to do us a favour and just keep rallying with a Pelka, but I don't know. I think if he does that, he wins. <laughs> It'll be quick. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, mate. I agree. So they go serving. To tie it up in the lot, second set. A lot of uh, ball bounces going on there. Big serve. Team, good return. Sonego, power forehand. Team, down the line. Good backhand from Sonego. Slice from team. Slice from Sonego. Team needs to start taking over these rallies a bit more for me. He's just playing out oh, oh, wide from Snago there. Disappointing. I think he needs to keep it deep. I know you say that, but team for me is growing into this match big time. He will. I can feel it. Match. I can feel he's growing into it. It's That's why he has similarities. I said it before the match. There are similarities with the Rafa thing. It, yeah. He does similar things on clay where he grows. As the match yeah. goes on. I feel he he's more... growing a little bit now, uh, team. 
The only thing that will keep him out. Oh, the Senego attacks the net. It's a dodgy volley. Team, can he pass him? Oh, he can't. Oh, what hands, though. That's world class again from him. How many Wrong. times are we going to say that? It's so difficult to, to anticipate where he's going and control a ball hitting you with that pace. Wrong decision for me to go cross court. I think he should have gone down the line. It was open more. I don't know. I think it was a really good anticipation. Make him make the backhand volley arguably more difficult as well. 15 all. Dominic team returns down the line. Now cross court. Senego runs around the backhand again. Loops it up for team forehand. Big forehand from team. Yeah. Forces the error from Senego. And how long have we had played in this match, man? I can't quite see. Oh, there we go. One hour, nine minutes. Yes. Interesting. One hour, nine minutes. Dominic team. It's 15.30. You can uh, see him now. growing. I can feel him growing. This could be a good opportunity for team to break. Um, it's all about the serve for me for Senego. If his first serve is popping, I think team... I don't know. I think he team's still, he's still in returning well. He can he can keep him at bay, though, with that first serve because he can do the one-two punch if he needs... Big serve. Team oh. gets it back in play, though. And it's long. Saying. He's Super returning well, team. He's returning very well. And team looks like, for me, he's going to take control of this set the way it's going right now. There we go. 15-40. Sanego looking at his box. He lit with a sort of anguish on his face. Dominic team blows on the hands, wipes the brow. The crowd clapping away. Trying to get Sanego out of this hole that's been dug. Serving oh. to the net as a second serve for team. The banger wants the team break by the looks of it, saying, come on, two break points. Oh, it was close to a double fault, but it wasn't. It was in just on the back of the service line. He runs around. He has a big forehand. Oh. Team's got it back in play somehow. He goes cross so court. It's a winner from Sanago. Borsa. Big, big, big winner there. Under pressure, facing break point. Saves one, but he's still got to save another one here. That's impressive because that serve looked close to a double fault as well. It this was the shot that made it here. Brilliant. He is Dicing with death playing that second serve though. <laughs> Couldn't get more perfect though, I have to say. Hit the hit the back of the service line. Yeah. It's a close one. Snago serving. One more break point for team. Good serve. He's attacking the net. Oh, Ooh. it's wide from team. Good <laughs> he idea. Just, he charged the net he after did. his serve. Team looked like he had a nice angle down the line, but just misses. A good idea from Sanego. Give him something else to think about. He did. He gave him a little bit extra there. He hasn't done the chip and charge. Well, it wasn't really a chip and charge. The serve and volley. Yep. The, got, the uh, Cressy. The Cressy. We've got Pizan <laughs> saying the pressure cooker now. Some nerves firing. <laughs> the pressure cooker. What's that in Italian? I don't know. Big serve. Good return from team off the first serve. He runs round his backhand. Big forehand from team. Cross court from Sanego. Team misfired his forehand wide. Yeah. Looked frustrated. It's one of them shots where he thought, why are you still in this rally? And he's gone for something ridiculous and it's not paid yep. off. A Sinego. poor decision. Really bad. He had, uh, he had Sanego where he wanted him in this in this uh, service game. And he just allowed the, 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 the power to go back to Sanego. And teams yep. looked a bit soft. Yeah, I'm not sure what's happened here. Sanego has changed up a bit. Very good play. I think good tactics. Changed it up. What's he got? Advantage. Big serve. Good shot back into play. He's gone with a drop shot. It's too yeah. good. He holds. Well what a hold. Yeah. How really. big is that going to be? I think that's going to really knock some stuff in out of team because it looked like the momentum was sort of shifting. Yeah. It really did. What what a way to play break points, though. Played yeah. incredibly well on the break points. Didn't get flustered. I thought the only chance for team was maybe if he double faulted there. He nearly double faulted on on break point but he, it, luckily it went in yeah well how does team respond to that disappointment of not breaking uh, when he's had the break point opportunities it's his turn to serve now big serve down the tee want to say thanks everybody for joining us for this matchup the last Italian standing in Rome oh. in 
Sorry, yeah, in rhyme. Sorry, it was just a terrible <laughs> shot from team there that was <laughs> flew long as I was saying that. If you haven't liked the video yet, guys, give us a like on the video. It really helps out Game to Love. And if you haven't joined the GTL family yet, hit that subscribe button, guys. Come on, jump on board. Join the Discord as well. There's a lot of people in there talking tennis 24-7. Yeah, and if you don't have access to watch some of the matches, you can watch them live on our Discord. Uh, there's a select few on there, and you can talk to people why it's on there. So I'll put the link for the Discord in the chat. It'll be great to see you over there. Indeed. Dominic team goes big forehand. Not enough angle on it for me. Oh, into the net into the from Sonego. Gift there from Sonego. Yeah. He didn't have to do that. He could have done a little bit better. The team would take it 15 all. Yeah, team keeping it just in the court. He's not going for too many angles not going too close to the lines he's playing a little bit tentatively at the moment i think it's worked on that point i'm not going to criticize him too much let's just see how he gets on in the next one good serve back in play team big backhand oh. down the line that's the one there it is yeah that's what you've been looking for mate yeah. all day and he's found it been waiting for it mate that is the shot is that button worthy no nah, not yet mate let's see if we can We've just not hold. see the team button it's not really it a good like. one. Yeah, it's not the best. Another player who needs an upgrade needs to get further in some tournaments. No, it's a fault there. Get a second serve to mate, look you at. You won the US Open when we were doing the podcast. Yeah, mate. That buttons weren't even a thing back then, were yeah. they? Yeah, that was before the buttons. It was before the buttons were invented. Team big forehand. Sonego gets it back in play. He's into Sonego's backhand. He attacks the net. Big smash. Oh, he missed. Ooh. He nah, missed. It wasn't. No, nah, it wasn't. Did he? I'm trying to say miss. I thought he it's missed nearly that. Missed. It it went... He nearly did. He went for the Sampras, mate. Both feet off the ground there. <laughs> the Mon Fees. <laughs> I like well, it, though. I can't even see it. No, that's good. <laughs> team, that team that going... might get him pumped a little bit. Team going for the showboat. I like it. It looked like he missed, mate. Even on the replay, it looked like he missed. All right. So Everyone's so it. sure it was in, but I don't know. It was in, clearly. What do I know? I can't see, clearly. So 40-15, Dominic team. Oh, into the net with his first serve. Ah, so pressure cooker, Ben. We actually know what it is. We've got Maria from Facebook. <laughs> just giving <laughs> you the translation. Uh, it's Pentela Apressione. Ah, Pentela Apressione. Pentela oh, Snego again, staying in this rally. Great back. Oh, it's long from team. He's going for that backhand again. He needs to warm it up, though. He's not gone for it enough. It's not going to be warm if you don't use it enough. Yep. Well, 40-30. And Sonego with a small window here to get back into this team service game. And Paggy Rossi saying, team, no good player. Well, I think he's fairly good. <laughs> Pretty good. I reckon he's better than you, Paggy. Yeah, he's up there. Serve. Oh, it's just long. Lucky for Sonego as his return went into the net. Second serve. Where's he going to put this one? It's gone down the tee. Good return from Snago. A bit of a miss hit from team. Snago attacks it and the winner. Finishes yeah. it off. Introduced now. A bit of a miss hit on the backhand side again from Dominic team. Misfiring. He has one good winner followed by two terrible backhands now. So... Juice, Dominic team under the cosh yet again on his serve. And the Italian fans getting behind Sanego right now. It's team serving. Good serve out wide. He comes into the net, finishes it off. Very good serve and very good put away. Advantage. The crowd appreciative of that great serve and put away as well. Bentagio team. So, advantage Dominic team. Be looking to get out of this horrible service game in the end. It's made it hard for himself, really. Well, look at his unforced errors. 13 unforced errors. Or was that Tanego? Um, it's a shame it's gone now. It went so quick. Need to have a look again. Oh, good serve again from Dominic team. And he's questioning that one. I think he thinks it was out. Yeah, I thought it was okay. And I there we know. go. I thought it was out. But... Sonego's challenging it. Oh, I thought it was out. And he's confident yeah. it is out. Yeah, I thought so as well. The crowd love it. They're like, yeah, yeah, definitely out. Yeah. 
I saw it. So we're going to have a second serve. He's not out of this service game yet. Yeah, definitely wide. I'm not surprised that the, um, oh, the line judge didn't get that. Good second serve. Good length on the return from Snay. He's gone with the drop shot. Dominic teams into the net. Goes with the backhand. It's too good from Sinego. Back at Juice. He's still not letting him go, is he? Uh, he's got team where he wants him. He's up a set. If he can break here, that's going to be huge for the Italian. I think the crowd's going to go mental as well. I don't think I might enough, as well. There's enough. There wasn't enough power in that backhand from team. He he just yeah. sort of placed it to him. He's so put, it, straight, another he hit. put it into the hitting zone. Straight yeah, into the that... hitting zone of Snake. I was like, oh, go on then. Have that one. For me, Juice. For, for me, he should have played the drop shot back. That was that would have been the shot, but it's easier said than done, isn't it? Wait, can you start saying Padita and Joko? Zanego. Joko. Oh, good serve. Comes in. There's the drop shot. Well done. That's what he should have done the last point. He played <laughs> the drop shot from the back. That's the thing. He played the drop shot from the baseline, Sanego. So you've got... What are you, an expert in drop shots all of a sudden? Nah, I did a Never few, seen you make one. Did a few against you, mate. You were running around. <laughs> Blowing out your arse. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you did. You'd have the audacity to hit a drop shot. You were just trying to get it over the net. Didn't know whether you were coming or going. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's long from team on the volley. Back to juice. Yeah, Paddy right pack. now. Right now, my my best shot looks like a drop shot. I can barely probably get it over the net. <laughs> I'm like Gal Falkenberg. Mate, I don't know why you keep saying that. She beats you. I keep saying it. Mate, well, we'll have to see. The big matchup will be set up at some point. She would beat me. Her serve's pretty good, Gail. Yeah? <laughs> Is it? <laughs> it's a bit of a slicey one. But anyway, guys, big thank you to everyone who's joined us. We've got 140 people here. If you haven't already, please leave us a like on this video. If we can get to 100 likes, that'll be awesome. Oh, good return from Sonego. He steps in. He comes into the net. He goes to the volley. Oh, it's into the net from Sonego. <sighs> what an opportunity. Oh, he should have had break point. He's going to be disappointed. And guys, He's if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. We're closing on 6K and we need your help to get there. Yeah, he set it up. He did everything right there, Sonego. He attacks the serve. He came to the net. Just a volley let him down this time. <sighs> disappointing. Team serving. Advantage. Good serve out wide. Sonego gets it back in play. Team goes back out to the Sonego backhand. He gets it back in play. Big winner. Come on, team. He finally holds. And we've got to give him a button for that hold. <laughs> finally, the weird team button is out. <laughs> I'm going to be too sexy. No worries, man. Doing my, exactly what I wanted to do. Which was a long game, and uh, unfortunately, no toilet break for me. <laughs> toilet break for JG, as we are now seeing. Dominic team, he got out of that game. Is that going to crush the spirit of Lorenzo Sonego a little bit? Yeah, and I agree here with Matthew saying, I do love a clay court match under the lights. Yeah, it was the one thing I was looking forward to. We sort of had it last Rome when... We had some epic matches here in Rome last year. Obviously, Djokovic, the eventual winner. I even remember one match when the lights went out. <laughs> Charlie saying, can you just play the Cinnabon just for fun? Such a tune. Well, I don't even think it's on the stream. I think uh, I removed it once he went out of the tournament. So I'd have to add it back in again to uh, to get that one played for you guys. But yeah, such a tune. I do agree. It is my favorite button to press. So maybe we can uh, get Yannick in. He is an Italian, as we know. Maybe, well, maybe the other Italian, if Sonego can do as well as, as him, maybe we'll see him with his own, well, his own style button, the same as Yannick Sinner has. Obviously, Sinner has a, a very nice button, very, very dancey, and uh, Sinner throwing a few shapes. But I wonder if Yannick Sinner is in the crowd anywhere watching this matchup, cheering on his fellow Italian. you got to imagine that somewhere he is. I remember, uh, well, he was in the stands earlier watching that Chapeau Rafa match. What a match that was. Quite incredible. So, Lorenzo Sonego, he's serving once more. 3 2 down. 
Can he hold his serve and push this into three all? So serve is just long. And just for you. Oh, so just for you, Charlie, we can have it once. Yannick Sinner. Well, hopefully Yannick Sinner, his dancing can help Lorenzo Sonego back to his best. It's love 15, though, in this game. Dominic team looking to get the break here. Is it going to be a repeat of what he did to Martin Fuchsovic in the, in the last round? It's wide serve there. We got uh, <laughs> Magdy saying, what the heck did I just watch? Well, it was Yannick Sinner pulling out some dance moves. Here we go. Sonego, second serve. Team runs inside out, forehand. Oh, was that in? I think it was. It clips the baseline. It's 15 all. What an incredible winner. And that is the, the problems you will come into if you run all the way around your backhand. He ran all the way around it on a wide serve. Hit it inside out forehand. Sonego had the whole court to aim at. Didn't even need to hit it that hard if he didn't want to. But he did. Smashed it in. Amazing shot winner. 15 all. Good serve out wide. Team gets in play. Drop shot there from Sonego. Team slips. And uh, didn't chase it up. <clears throat> Charlie saying... You witness art. <laughs> Thanks, legend, for that. It was brilliant. <laughs> yeah, it was. It was. I know you're talking about the backhand. 30-15, Sonego. And uh, Kakashi saying, yeah, team isn't very smart with those inside-out forehands. <sighs> Close to an ace there from Sonego. It will be a second serve, though. For Sabasa saying Nadal Zverev again. I think Sasha beats him again. Well, he's going to have confidence going into the matchup. Nadal might have a few nerves. Good serve from Sonego. Good return from team. Sonego playing into the backhand of team. Loops it up. Dominic team inside out forehand. Goes with the drop shot. Sonego's in. Plays it. He hits the net cord. Team winner down the line. I think it's in. He's looking at it. He's not sure. It is in, though. <laughs> Devanga saying, I still love the way you believed in Alcaraz. Well, you had to. Somebody had to. And Dominic team, we finally get to see the passing shot backhand down the line. And it did just clip the outside of the line. Good call from the line judge. <laughs> Kakashi. I think it's uh, just got a problem with his ankle. He's just taking him a bit longer. Great serve there from Lorenzo Sonego and Ace. He needed that. Rishi saying, I love team. Yeah, great player, especially when he's playing his best tennis. JG returns just in time for Sonego to potentially serve out. This one. Yeah, mate. Sorry about that. I'm, I'm watching it. It's just um, my phone <clears throat> was going to die, so I had to get the power pack. Oh, and gonna... he serves an ace and he holds. Three games oh. all. I was going to say you stole my uh, toilet break, but it's fine. <laughs> mate, the crowd's going absolutely mental. <laughs> uh, and apparently, Shavam saying Ruble putting in a very good performance so far. Yeah, he is. He's 3-1 up against Batista Agut. Andre Ooh. Rublev could be a potential dark horse for this tournament, maybe. Who did you have in the bracket? Did you have Rublev or Agut? I think I had Rublev. But there was part of me that thought today, yeah, I did have Rublev. I had Garin to beat Batista Agut, so I don't know what I was talking about, thinking there. <laughs> didn't, do, it. didn't do well at all. <laughs> Another terrible call from me. Oh, Sonego return into the net. Needs to at least make team play another shot. Well, the pressure's back on team here. Sonego, that was a big hold from him. 
Massive. Massive hold. Team serve. Oh, great volley in there from team and team doing the serve volley now. Yeah. Well played. And I think this is so big. If he is to force it to a third, I think team, I think your prediction would be right. I think team wins it in three. I think Senego's best chance is just getting this done in two. And that's what they were saying really with Chapo earlier. He needs this done as soon as possible in the second set because if Rafa wins it, there's only really one player winning in the third. But it was still close to third. Gave Chapo a lot of credit there. Team goes for the drop shot. It's poor decision into the net. Tried yep. to mix it up. I want to say shot. people are asking, "Am I all right?" <laughs> Sorry, guys, I had to get this. This little. No, they thing. thought you were in the loo. No, no, I had to get this. Uh, yeah, I want to say thanks, everybody. 150 people in. We've only got 54 likes on the video. Come on, guys, let's get this up to 100 if we can. Dominic team serving 30-15. Oh, just wide. Second serve. Sonego seems to get into his service games quite a lot. And this is where he broke a uh, team in the first set at this moment here, wasn't it? I believe so, yeah. Dominic team going inside out forehand again. It's so good. Oh. It hits the line. Sonego's frustrated, but it's definitely in. It just clips yeah, the line. Incredible sh shot there yeah. from Dominic team. He keeps going to the well with this inside out. Inside out forehand, though. I'm surprised that he's still worried about hitting the backhand as many times as he can. Like he, he's hit a few winners. He did one when you were out. When, mate, when you've got a forehand like team, though, you don't need to hit the backhand so much. Oh, a good shot there from Sonego. Great drop shot from team. Great shot. Yeah. He well answered played. the drop shot with a drop shot, as he should have done before. And there we go. He leads. He did what he couldn't do in the first set, and he's 4-3 up now in ah. the second, but we're on serve. I'm glad that changeover went quicker than the last one. Now I can have my toilet break. Can you hit the statistics, please? Sure thing. Sorry, man. mate. Cheers. No worries. As Ben goes, we'll just go through a few, a few statisticos there. You've got the ace count. Obviously, four aces for Sonego. Bit of a bigger server than team so far. Uh, team with the one double fault. First serve win uh, percentage, both pretty even. S 69 for team, 73 for Sonego. Um, Look at the stats, really. It's all very even. Not much separating the stats at all. First serve points one, more or less the same. Uh, and second serve points one, pretty similar as well. So it's just emphasising that it is very important to try and get as many first serves in as possible. But these two players have been doing it, and that's what really showing in the score there's not been anything really separating them this second set. I thought team had a good opportunity to break early doors. He didn't do it. So now he goes out a bit more confidence getting back into it. But only time will tell who's going to come out on top. I think it's going to be a really evenly contested second set. And uh, maybe could go all the way to a tie break, which probably team would win. Uh, his record in tie breaks is one of the best on the tour right now. But uh, let us know, guys, who do you think is going to win? We've got Dabanga going 6-4 team to win the second set. You've got Paggy still going for Sassanego. Um, we've got 12 Travel 21 saying, do you think Karatsev lost because Bitcoin's plummeting? Uh, should put Ethereum in his song instead. I think Ethereum's dropping as well. Elon Musk has cursed all of cryptocurrency right now and everything's dropping fast. Um, and it's quite fitting the fact that Karatsev loses on the day that Bitcoin Bitcoin falls. Sad day. We've got Forza Barca here going 7-5 team in the second set. Personally, hate to say it, I'm going to go... I'm going to go 7-5 for Sonego. I'm going to have to stick with my initial thing. Before a ball was hit today, I was going for uh, a straight set victory for Sonego. So I'm going to stick with that theme. I think the crowd's going to keep cheering him on and getting behind him and it's definitely possible. We've got Magdi going I think 6-4, 4-6, 6-3 Senego. Interesting. I think if it goes free, I think team doesn't lose. Well, let's see. He's doing the chip and charge again. He's gone with the big loopy lob. Oh, it nearly works as well. Yeah. Pretty comfortable so far. 30 love. That's what he needs to do. You, uh, Kakashi here going. I think Senego's taking it in straights. Agrees with me. Good, well do. Dominic team looking a little bit stressed about that chip and, well, serve volley, chip and charge style approach from Sonego. It sort of flusters you. 
Let first service. Well, will we make it to the tiebreaker as if? Well, approaching the business end, this is a big, big moment. I went for 7-5, mate, while he was away. That's what I'm going. Oh. Sinego to win, 7-5. I don't have to go uh, Dominic team in a tie break. That's about yeah. the only way I can see it going at the moment. Yeah. Uh, Lorenzo Sinego going for a game to love at the moment. Well, it's good serving from him. Really good serving. He really needs... Yeah, he really needs uh, something extra here. And Batista or Guts broken back against Rublev, but it was a double break oh. uh, Rublev have, so he's leading 4-2 Ooh. still. Is it no better time than to play that terrible shot from Sonego than being 40 love up. So he'll be relieved that it's not a, a significant point that he's done that error on. On the whole, mate, I'm so impressed with Sonego. We've had an hour or 33 minutes played. He's up a set. He's on serve. He's forcing it almost to a to a, a business end in the second set against team. And Lorenzo Sonego is looking good. And he's flying the Italian flag right now. Massetti's out. Berrettini's out. But Sonego's still in. And he's doing it for Italy in Rome right now against Dominic Team. The world indeed. number four. Oh, he goes with the drop shot. Dominic Team's into the net. He goes with his own. That's the shot. That is the shot I told you about. He yeah. plays the drop shot from the baseline. Team, answer it with a drop shot. He did, and he won the point. Perfect. See? Because he's out of position. He's not expecting the drop shot. He has to run all the way in then. Yeah, I wasn't expecting either. Good, well played, team. Mate, that's the shot. I should be in team's corner. I'll be If oh, I was in the crowd, I'd be yelling mate, it out. This is scary. From 40 love up, is at 40-30. Now, this point's so big. He needs like an ace or something. People in the crowd would probably like beat me up if I was yelling out. Wow, great serve from uh, yeah, Sonego. That's exactly what he needed. And we're at four all. It is the business end of the second set. Wow, the deciding moments of this second set right now. Of the match, really. Potentially, mm. if Sonego goes to break here, it would be serving mm. for the match. Hmm. You never know. Well, if this uh, goes to a third, and then it, I'll run to the shop and get another beer. <laughs> so, it's only two two minutes at, at the, outside the house. No good, mate. What's the plan? So he's missed Come on, first team. serve, or was it let? Give me cause to go to the shop. Come on, team. Was it let or missed first serve? Nah. No, it was fine. Oh, he won the point. Oh, yeah, yeah he won nice. the point. So team fifteen love up. A lot of people asking about the Zverev Nadal match. Well, let's focus on this one. This one's an epic yeah. one that's taken place right this second, and we're into the business end. Let's give these guys a bit of a uh, their own limelight. I think Sonego deserves a lot of limelight right now. He's yeah. playing out of his skin. Ah, uh, yeah, just just learn. Just long with that serve. Second serve for Sonego to have a look at. Yeah, definitely was long. Where's he put in this second serve? A great serve out wide. Dominic team hitting the power, but Sonego returning it. Chopped down the line. Sonego going in the slice cross court. Oh, terrible shot there from team. Just sliced it and he went nowhere. Complete gift, 15 all. And this is nerve wracking now for Sonego. It's a little uh, avenue. The crowd's getting up for it. You can't hit those shots against Sonego, though, where you don't try and put it into a a corner deep enough. He hits him too <coughs> centralized, these shots, and Sonego hits it back with just as much power and then teams on the defensive all of a sudden. Yeah. Drop shot errors. What a stat that is. Three for team, two for Sonego. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I need to talk to you about Gene Geneva as well in a minute, but maybe Ooh. wait for this bit because I feel like there's a big moment in the match. Could well be. 15 all. Second stuff, double fault from Dominic team. Oh, and 15, no, 30, is he falling apart right yeah, now? Yeah, this is bad signs for team. You don't want to be double faulting in the business end. Every point is worth so much. We've got 170 people watching this one. Team's just double faulted. If you're enjoying the video, please leave us a like on this video. And if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. We're going to be covering tomorrow semi final. Well, not semi final, that'll be the next day. We've got semi final on the weekend and the final. We're going to be doing Djokovic tomorrow, but maybe Nadal as well. So this is the place to be. Hit the bell, hit the subscribe button, and uh, stay on, on Game to Love. Indeed. Dominic team. 
Oh, it's a terrible drop shot again. Add another one to that drop shot. Eric. Borsa, Borsa, come on. Why did he hit that shot? 15-40, so, Lorenzo Sonego. He, he had the whole court to aim at there, and he went for the drop shot. Two break terrible. Points. Two terrible. break points. Ben's pick's going out. Ben's pick's going out. This is what oh, we want to see on the to. podcast. If he plays <laughs> like that, he deserves to. <laughs> terrible. But hit through the ball. Well, you got a cheap one there, but good serve, got... really good serve, Dominic team, and if he saves one break point. If you get the opportunity to hit a winner into an open court, do it. Don't just try and play these silly little drop shots. Yeah, but you were saying he needs to do more of the drop shots. No, nah, he answers a drop shot with a drop shot. That's what I was saying. <laughs> okay, because it works. I'm following. So one Ace break from point Dominic here. team, and it's. Sonego's going to have a look at it. He can't believe it, but he's seen in the line for himself. Yeah, it is, cute. and there we go. He's saved both of them, Dominic T. You're being a bit wow. harsh on your man. Nah, he's mate. not done yet. I'm I'm not being harsh on him. He needs to cut out those stupid errors. <laughs> Big serve needed here. Goes down the tee again. Great serve. Goes into the Sonego backhand. Great volley from team. And the fist pump comes out. Yeah, what a moment to be doing it. He was down two break points now. He's advantage up. And uh, he just answered a lot of critics there with some yeah. big, big, ballsy play from Dominic Team. Come on, big set here from Dominic Team. My sh local shopkeeper wants you to win this set. He wants some extra money for those <laughs> beers I'm going to go and get. <laughs> Volley winners now, they've got three and three. Wow. <laughs> I don't know they're why they really, do it if there's not many. Like Very even stats, I think. That's why they're doing them all. So, advantage. Second serve. Is Sonego going to attack this and then attack the net? Ooh. Oh, team big forehand. It's into the net and he holds and we're at the magic five. Let's go, Dominic team. Big hold. Massive yeah. hold. He can't really be too critical of Sonego there. No. He did well to get to the break point stuff, but then it was all in Dominic team in terms of turning that around. Yep. He served three or four huge serves, and there was nothing Sonego could have done to, on any of them, to be fair. And as Forster says, Forster Buster says, and that's a massive hold. And now it, it may, means hold. he's only one game away from a potential third set here under the lights in Rome. Mate. That was just what he needed, just what the doctor ordered, so to speak. Dominic team, you haven't seen him serving as well as that the whole match. And he yeah. pulls them out when it matters. And it's I don't pretty want... late in Rome, right? Must be what, nine o'clock now? Yeah, nine o'clock, playing under the lights. Beautiful. When do they stop anyway. playing in Rome? I oh, may. They'll be playing for a while, yeah. It's at least midnight. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. There's not, it's not going to be uh, It's going to be finished tonight, that's for sure. Yeah, yeah. Unless there's some bizarre. Well, you've got the other match. That could, that's sort of a good sort of coming back into it slightly. Mm, I say maybe. slightly. There's, they're at juice on his serve. He needs to hold here, but Rublev's leading 4 2. Austin Seems to be Nelson's going quite ten. slow that first set. I am team team. <laughs> <laughs> nice to know. Ben's team team as well. Nanda reckons team breaks right now. Then third set. Don't worry. It's over. Well, I'm very confident. I wish I was as confident as you. No, I agree. If, if teams to win this set, I think it is over for Sonego. We saw what he did to Martin. Mate, this is, Itali this is Italian in Italy, though. Anything can happen. They're under the lights in Rome. We've seen crazy things happen last year. Schwartzman, one of them. Sonego's got to do something big here. He's got to hold his serve to start off with. It's a fault. Second serve to look at. He needs his first serves in this service game. He's serving to stay in this second set right now. Second serve. Where is he going to place this one? It's like you can hear a pin drop in there. He's gone down the middle of the service box. They're playing it fairly central. Team goes inside out forehand into the Sonego backhand. And again, Sonego runs round it. And team whips that forehand. It's a drop shot. Team's got there. Sonego's too good. Come on. Well played, Sonego. You're a little bit in front of me, mate, so I'm just listening to you and then watching it on my mind. Oh, go and refresh, mate, because I'm on the same as you. Okay, I'll refresh. 
Maybe that's what it is. Yeah, I had to refresh the beginning because you were ahead of me. I think it does that sometimes. Yeah, it's weird. But 15... Some, somehow we lose it. We start on the same and then we lose <laughs> time. <laughs> Must be the internet or something, surely. Yeah. But 15 love, Sonego, good start. Good serve. It's wide from team. Come on, this you could is have so done good. About that. Really good. Serving. In fact, it's the match has turned into a very serve orientated match. Team there saved his skin <laughs> from serve. Sonego serving his skin from just serving now. And uh, exactly. it's opposite to how the first set was going, where we were just seeing non stop rally after rally. Exactly, mate. 30 love. Sonego really focused right now. Big serve. Oh, I think it was long, wasn't it? Yeah. No one called out. They're just we're all just we're all just assuming it's out these days. No one even bothers calling. Second serve, Sonego. Down the tee. Oh, it's nearly out that one. All the drop shots poor though oh, from so Sonego. Good. No! Bad time for it. Oh no, this is scary. I think it was a wrong choice there because the ball bounced up nicely for him. He could have just swatted that away. He's got yeah. a great forehand. I think so as well. Well, 30-15, the crowd getting behind him, getting the applause going. Mate, Batista are good. trying to make a big comeback here. Oh, really? He's trying to force it to four all. Good serve Go out back wide. This Great one. backhand from team. Oh, it's oh, long. It's still in play. No, it's not. It's long. 30 oh, all. What's what a return. What a return Dominic from team. team. Two points away it's... now from this second set. One of the best returns of the match from Dominic team on the backhand side there. It was such a short yeah. angle. Landed just inside the service box, cross court. Well, something we've got to remember is teams had the best practice, really, for this return. He played John Isner the other week, didn't he? <laughs> Mate. Playing John Isner, I think that's the perfect preparation for a match like this. Go and play Riley Opelka. <laughs> it's a big... It's an ace, and what a time to pull one out. Clutch serving. He's not hit many, but that's a big though. ace for him. 40-30, and he that's needs to get out of this game. Mate. Today, that's been, it's been the same as Opelka, mate. He does the same on that side. It swerves away yeah, from no, you. Yeah, no, do side. He's been serving well out wide. Yeah, exactly right, mate. It's only because Rafa serves down the tee, doesn't he, usually? Yeah. But it's this side is the one which wins you the matches. Down the tee. And it's long. Second yeah, you're right. Serve. He always second serves on, on the ad side. It's the same as what Opelka was doing earlier today as well. It's very strange. I think it's just must be a right-handed uh, thing. Team's anticipated it for the backhand. He's gone. He's run round it. Team's gone backhand into Sonego forehand. Forehand from team. Cross court. Sonego hit the net cord. Team's oh. attacks it inside out forehand. He could have attacked it more. Yeah, he's going slices into the net. It's oh, five all. There we go. Ford Sassanego holds. We're at five all now. Massive. Tie break, mate. Tie break in imminent here. Or is it going to be my prediction? What did I say? Seven five, Sonego. Could be, mate. Team. We're both on the cards. You went team tie break. I said Sonego seven five. So he won't gain any confidence from that poor backhand slice into the net. I tell you that much. 5 all and the crowd are oh, rowdy there in got, Rome. Look at them Frank jumping. from Italy joining. Ford says going Cinque Pari. Cinque Pari. <laughs> oh, he's questioning it. Was it long? Are they, are they questioning it? I'm not sure. It looked so, I, seems I thought to question, it was an ace. I thought, I thought it was, it was an, an ace. ace. Sonego seems to question every single one that uh, goes past him there. Yeah. Quinninci Zello. 15 love. Oh, oh, there's a lot of people shouting. Great serve. Yeah, you can see right on the line. Yeah. Caught half the line there. Great serve again. And now he's into the net. Can Sonego lob him? It's great. What a lob. <laughs> oh, what a lob. And he's going mad. He's like Rafa when he won in Barcelona. Sonego looks possessed right now. And what a brilliant lob. Shot Incredible. of the match for me. Yeah. By far. That is so good. How he's so flicked good. that. That is incredible. Team jumped and he still couldn't get there. Come on, Sonego. He knew. He knew. <laughs> he knew there was no point even extending a racket. It was one of those ones where you just know. Great serve down the tee. It's returned. 
Good forehand. So now you go forehand. It's long, though. Good serving from the team. All the hard work the he did as well. It's such a shame to have one brilliant shot followed by that. Well, it's a difficult one. I think team did very team. well. Yeah. Credit to team serving. Team hanging in there right now. Really needs another big first serve here. Needs to needs to get on top of this match and on top of Sonego and on top of this crowd. Oh, he's hit the net cord. It's a fault. Second serve to look at here for Sonego. Wonder what tactic he's going to employ. It's into the backhand side. Sonego gets it back inside that forehand. Great shot from team. Oh, there's a shot there from oh. Sonego. It's just landed short. He's gone with the lob again. Oh, he's questioning this. He's questioning it. He's, he's saying, saying it's, it's out. out. I'm not sure. Yep, it's out. Yeah, it's out. There we go. Big point that for Sonego. Wow. It's 30 all. Two points away from breaking. And I must admit, wow. he was a bit fortunate. There's no way he meant that as a drop shot. I think it was a miss hit. Nah. would come off and look like a drop shot. Uh, but Sonego, very close now from getting this one over the line against Dominic Team would be one of his biggest career wins. Obviously, this is a Rome Masters tournament. Yep. It's huge. Massive. 30 old Team needs a big first serve right now. The crowd going wild in Rome. It's long on the first serve. He's got a second serve to look at here, Sonego. That's just what he would want right now. Where's team going to place this one? Gets it in down the tee. Good return. Team goes down the line into the forehand side. It's a good return cross oh! court. Team can't get it in. It's a Come break on! point. Come on, break point. Whoa. Wow. Man, this is mad. Some really good tennis. And I was just trying to find out what is... Uh record looks like in Masters tournaments and I can't find anything well, right now. the Italian's on the run, mate. He'd made him go on the run and he hit an amazing cross-court winner. Break point, Sonego. Yeah, he's never done anything any good in any Masters event ever. Best quarterfinal in, in uh, Monte Carlo 2019. Oh, it's big. Oh, it's just oh, long. He made it. Wow. I just team saw it out of the corner brave. of my hand. I thought we made it. Wow. So there you go. Did so well there, but so close. Almost made that it. shot. Got a racket on it and it angled perfectly, but just too hard. He couldn't take a team had so much power on that shot. He couldn't control it. Luckily Parita. for team. Parita juice. <laughs> Let. Let. Now, this is a pressure moment, mate. I want it to be 7-5 because it means I called two sets all. I know. I literally called the score right as well if I get two love. 6-4, well, 7-5. <laughs> want to see Dominic team hold his serve here. Good serve. Chopped back into play. He goes inside out points. Wide. It's another break point. Brilliant reply, though. Really good confidence from Sonego. I'm surprised he just swatted getting... it back. Yeah, and I'm team looks so angry at himself. He's shouting at the tennis balls. He looks so angry. Yeah, and he I'm should be angry because he doesn't make make their mistakes so often. I'm surprised that he's able to get all of team's powerful serve just back in play so well. It's really great returning from Sonego today. I think he's surprising himself. It's full. Second serve to look at. There's a lot of people right now watching this match, hoping for Sonego to break right now. Oh, he's hit the baseline with that backhand team. Sonego's gone backhand. Team's backhand down the line. Sonego on the run. It's into the net. It's a save break point. Oh, and he's got a laugh. Oh, he's, uh, I can't believe it. Dominic team's hit the baseline twice there. I want to say, if you're enjoying this, if you're nervous watching this right now, please help out our channel. Hit that like button on the video, guys. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button too. Oh, that's it so is juice to again. Team, oh, I don't know if it's fortunate or just skill, but how nice. did he hit the how did he hit the baseline there? No nice. way. So there you guys didn't break. Ace from team again on that down the T serve. What a clutch serve again from Dominic team. He's pulling team, them out. Team does matters. not look, doesn't not know when he's beaten right now. 
He, he can't afford to be. He has watched the match earlier today, and there's a one guy that he looks up to on the clay courts, Mr. Rafael Nadal. He needs to emulate him right now. Oh, it was close to another ace, but apparently just wide. Second serve to look at for Sanego again. Into the backhand side of Sanego. Can announce Rublev taking the first set in the other match. Oh, it's just long and it's a game for team. He finally holds another big hole for Dominic team. Oh, I'm thing. just so upset. That is deflating. I think that's going to really affect Sanego's confidence slightly. I'm oh, worried now for him. So. I I'm think worried for him. I'm not worried. I think he's actually all right, mate. I think he played really well in that game. Oh, yeah. He played brilliant, but he was just defying margins. I think team was just playing very clutch, and you've got to just maybe just give all the credit to team. He's shown that he's been in this position many times before on the clay courts, a bit more experienced than Sanego. And he's just shown it there. And that there, them, that, that hit the backhand and hit the line. And I don't know how he's done some of them shots, to be fair. I'm kind of speechless with it. I think Sanego was good value for the break. But teams just prevented him. He's found the way. And we're in a real match here. 6-5 team leads in this second set. Sanego now has to serve this one to force it to a tie break. Otherwise, we're going to three. Indeed, mate. Oh, mate, it's crazy. Yeah, it could still go to three, even if it goes to the tie break. That's what I've predicted. I think we Sonego's been serving so well for for me. I I don't even think, even if he has a bit of nerves, I think he's really got that serve nailed down, especially on the juice side. Yeah, but mate, it's a different thing serving when you're nervous. And... Well, he did it in the last one. He was 5-4 down. And he did exactly the same. Yeah, he looked he's going to have to do the same thing again. Yeah, I think he's looked good. I don't think he's looked bad at all under pressure. The crowd, uh, he's, he's embracing the crowd, if anything. It's not affecting him in a negative way at all. The problem is, as 12 Travel 21 says, team is the king of tie breaks. Well, and I'm slightly wants, worried probably. here. At worst, team's going to get a tie break this set and he's going to be big favourite now for this set. Well, let's wait and see because I bet there's probably a few thousand Italians in that stadium that disagree with you. They're going to try and will Sanego to a victory right now in two sets. Sanego to serve. Here we are, back out on court. Team needs to get focused right now. Adjusting. Oh, it's an ace. Good start. That's how you start, mate. The juice side again. How many aces has that been for him now? Uh, I'll have a quick look, mate. I think it's been quite a few. Um, seven. Seven. Yeah, mate. It's pretty, pretty good. Pretty good on clay. Yeah, it's good numbers, actually. Against team, a good returner. Definitely. It's that serve out wide, though. It's nearly impossible to get to. It's the one Karatsev was hammering Medvedev with. He comes in, the serve volley. Oh, it's not good enough. He, oh, he's gone with the smash. Oh, no. What's he done? He's hit that <laughs> in the net. Sonego. That's got to be one of the worst shots I've ever seen. He had That's one of the worst shots I've ever seen. I can't believe he's missed it. And the it all started with the bad volley from yeah, the serve. Okay, volley. that's not that bad. No, but this the, one here, you just have to tap it over. He's missed it. it he's not even start. frustrated with himself. He's just yeah, gone back like that's normal. Was in his head, mate. I think he'd already got mentally beaten from that first volley. Should have put it away straight away. Quindici party. He goes out wide. Team and guesses him this time. And now he's into the rally. And Sonego plays it down the line. Can team hit the winner? Sonego's got the volley. Can team get there? He's gone down the line. Sonego volleys again. Can team get there? He's gone with the lob. Sonego, he can't get there. It's a oh, great... my God. <laughs> wow. Oh, my gosh. Wow. What a point. If you guys can't watch this, I feel sorry for you. This match is amazing some of the some of the uh, the tennis is out of the world out of this world it is clay court genius from both players and that's what happens when you go to the well on a serve too many times dominic team just stood over there and said go on then hit it out wide this time i'm there waiting for it and he got it back in play and look what happened when he was in the rally total points won in this match 72 apiece 15 30 
Big serve. Dominic team gets the return in. It's wide and it's two set points for Dominic team now and the crowd groans. Yeah. Disappointing. Looks like we could be going to three here. Uh, if you're a team fan, you'll be thrilled because he's just performed some... Well, he's just not given up. He's not known when he's been beaten at all. He's fighting so hard, showing what a warrior he is on these clay courts. He is a warrior right now. Can he get this over the line or are we going to see some... Big serves again on this juice side. Is team going to second guess him? Is Sonego going to change up and go down the tee? We'll see. He's gone out wide again. It's a fault though. And now he's got a second serve to look at. He was see? he was charging to the net as well on that one. Exactly. Well, is it that he changed it up again. He's just trying to mix oh, it up. No. To... He can't Se do this on the second serve, is he? No, well, he can't. I think he needs to get it in. He's, well, he's got to. He's probably going to go down the middle. There it is, down the middle. Team, oh, shank. Oh, my word. <laughs> Dominic team with a shank. Yeah. Now, he's not adverse to the nerves either. Dominic team still feels them. So. Anyway, one set point. And one set point for Dominic team. We've had one hour, 59 minutes played. We've got about an hour a set right now. Well, second set 30, point. 30, 40. Can he get it over the line? He's going to need a big serve here. Big serve. Back into play. Gets it over into the forehand side. Team loops it up. Sonego goes with the forehand inside out. Team, it's into the net and he saved good. another. Come on, Forza! Wow. Big one. Full to you. If this you are big. enjoying this match right now, guys, please help out GTL. Hit that like button. And if you're new, hit that subscribe button. We're going to be bringing you more action tomorrow as well. Yeah, we've got Djokovic sit to pass on the pod on the live watch along tomorrow. So yes. please hit that subscribe button. This is the place to be. But right now, Sonego struggling to hold his serve. He's at juice. Needs an ace. It's gone down the middle this time. Team returns it back into play. Oh, it's long from team. Another Come error. Come on. And advantage Sonego. This fight from Sonego is incredible. He does not know when he's beaten right now. No, he does not. Well, Sonego, can he push this match into a tie break? One serve away. Good serve. Good return from team. Good length on it. Good shot. Inside out forehand. Dominic team backhand. Sonego forehand. <gasps> team forehand. Slice from Sonego. Slice from team. He attacks the net. It's too good. Yeah, it's really good approach shot from team. He sliced it and he knew that it was going to be a tricky one to deal with. Yeah, mate. He attacked the net, did the chip and charge. Yeah. Put Sonego under the same pressure that he's been putting team under this match. <sighs> Back to juice. Team two points away from the set. Sonego two points away from the tie break. What is going to happen? Let us know in the, in the, in the live chat. Who do you want to win this match? <laughs> Rishi's saying I love team more than my girlfriend <laughs> <laughs> oh it's a fault there on that oh, juice side oh, again oh, I thought it was maybe an ace I know <laughs> he was looking for it. he thought it was and that guy shouted loud Dominic team waiting for this second serve now down the middle team goes down the line with this one mixes it up and it's wide it's caught him off guard that one great return from team and it is set point one more time oh gosh i know come on get this done so i can run to the shop come on <laughs> <laughs> third set point for dominic team so now you guys pulled something out special every time though on set point. Can he do it one more time? Can he do it? He needs to get this to a tie break. Needs a big first serve here on the ad side. It's another big serve. Team's got it back into play. It's cross court. It's too good from Sonego. Come on. There he goes. He saved another one. So good. Please just get so it to good. a tie break. Come on. He deserves a tie break. He deserves so to hold his serve here. He's playing so well. Playing really well. That's clutch serving. Big serve. Team, he, he's only as quick as a, a human could be. And oh, he kicked something over there in the corner. It's so annoyed. What was he kicked over there? God knows. Juice number three. Juice. Team. 
He's frustrated right now. Oh, he tried to go down the tee. Notice that one went quite long. He's got another second serve. The first serve's going in on the other He's side. He's going down now. the middle. He's going down the middle. <laughs> I think, well, yeah, it's down the middle on the second this is serve a, this every is a time. soft one, usually. Yeah, always. Yeah. Just keep it in. And Dominic team needs to take control of these rallies right now. He's going into the Sonego backhand. It's wide. It is wide. Come on. We've got set. We've got, no, not set point. We've got game <laughs> point for Sonego now. Let's get to the tie break. Forza Sonego. Come on. Day. Wow. Sonego showing true heart and grit and determination right the now. The crowd needs to get more pumped. They're not really offering enough right now. They've got to be quiet. Nervous. I think they're nervous. They're probably more yeah. nervous than Sonego. I think so. You've got Magdi going and Diamo. Come on. Here we go, Sonego. He's been finding big serves on the ad side. Can he find another? And he does. Team's got it back in with interest, though. Now he plays into the backhand side. It's into the net from Sonego. Just when you, he can't hold two points in a row, it's ridiculous. Neither player can. This, this is, is so why hard to watch. This is why juice was invented in tennis. <laughs> and how many juices is that? Is that four now? Uh, one, two, three, four, mate. Correct. And what's it been? Three set points. Three set points. Oh, Sine goes, what's he doing with his <laughs> hemp bands? <laughs> messed it all up. What's he doing? Something going a bit weird there with his headband. He was his covering his eyes. Falling out of the I thought headband. he was, was going to blindfold himself for the next <laughs> serve. <laughs> he might get out of it. Might actually return it. He's like, this, this, he'll never know where I'm going if I blindfold myself. <laughs> Come on. Big serve. Team anticipates it. Oh, it's long, though. Come on. Come on. Game point again, again for Sonego. Let's get this done now. Let's get it done. Wow. Dominic team is, he doesn't know which way to look at the moment. Wherever he looks, there's an Italian staring at him. That's all. That's, that's the problem right now. might get the, the his match finished before this one ends. <laughs> I think Because so. he's two love up. He's up a set against the good and he's two love up in the second. Sonego serving. Can he get it over the line? Good serve. It's wide and he holds. Come on, we're going to the tie break. He saved three set points against Dominic Team, the world number four, and Sonego's going to the tie break. But one thing, Ben, Dominic Team in tie breaks is a dangerous, dangerous prospect. It doesn't get any tenser than this, does it? And this is the business end. I can, I can uh, officially yeah. announce. The business end of all business ends, it would seem. It's tie break time, guys. If you're enjoying the stream, we've got over 300 people here. Please leave us a like on this video. Well, uh, and if you're new to the channel, dies. hit the subscribe button. The crowd dies as Dominic team gets a first serve in and Sonego hits it into the net. So uh, it's a bit sad there to see. A lot of Good people still shouting team. out. Wow. There's still people giving predictions for the third set at the moment i'm not sure why we're still in this tie break so now he goes could potentially get this done in two guys wait and see Snago so serving big serve down the tee teams smashed it miles it's long it's out really good serve down the tee yeah, really and it's good. one all i think i think this is the biggest one if he has that scoreboard advantage of going in front in this tie break it then has two serves to look at at team and the pressure is off him. Yeah. Needs it. For Sabasa saying, imagine he wins the tiebreak against the tiebreak king. Magdi's going, for oh. Sassanego. Come on. Oh, it's just long on the serve there. I think he just needs to keep on holding his serves here. He can't let team get an advantage in this tiebreak. Second serve. It's down the middle. Team oh, loops it up. Now. Great, great depth. Great forehand from team. He's on the stretch. It's wide and a mini break yeah. from Dominic team. Great hitting. But, mate, it's only a small... These tie breaks, mini breaks don't really mean a lot. I think you need to get a, even big leads I think, sometimes. I still think that's a big point for team. In tie breaks, when he takes the lead, he's so good. 
Right. He really is. He, he's someone who's able to dissect every ball as it doing. is. I know what you're doing. I know what you're doing. I know what you're doing. What do you mean? I'm not like doing it. anything. I'm not doing anything. Stop trying to... Team, when he's team. in the front, this set's over. I think we're already going you're to You're disgusting. Your behaviour <laughs> on this podcast is disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just give, give some third set predictions in there already. <laughs> <laughs> Our team back out oh, winner down the line. There it is. Well played, team. 3 1. He consolidated the mini break, and it was one of the trademark backhand down the line. That's what we want to see. The backhand down the line. If you love that backhand down the line, hit that like button for a backhand down the line. <laughs> for the backhand down the line and the backhand down the line. But 3 1 Dominic team right now. Winner speed. That was 152 kilometers an hour. Pretty solid. Loving that. Dominic team. Can he consolidate the mini break? He needs to get this serve in. Oh, it's just wide on this first just serve. Just miles long. Terrible right. first serve from Dominic team. Right. Could he get double fault now? Get his back. <laughs> Good second serve. It's long. And there you go. 4 1. He consolidates the mini break. And the yeah, crowd that's, that's getting so riled up at the moment. <sighs> this is sad. Give us some uh, tie break predictions in the live chat. I'm going to yeah. go 8 6 and a go. Oh, that's a, a tasty one. So the crowd would love that. Uh, I'm going to go 7 14. Okay. Played it so safe, yeah. needs. Well, I'm just going with your one. I know you love 7 4. So yeah, I but 7 I'd... 4 is like oh, boring, oh, Ben. He's back. We'll wait and see. We'll wait and see. It's into the net now. He can't find the first serve, Sonego. Dominic team looking at this second serve. Everybody in the crowd can't even they can't even speak right now. They can't they're holding their breath. Good good return from team. Goes down the line this time. Cross court backhand. Dominic team, big backhand. It's into play from him. But he's gone for the drop shot. Sonego gets there. It's cross court winner from Sonego. <laughs> Come on, Sonego. And he's kept his dream of this second set alive with that. Wow. Because if you missed it, 5-1, you're not looking good. Just for the returning. Out, and this just, is a big moment. Come on. If you can hold this up that here, backhand. pressure's back on team. Just for returning the backhand, mate. That was power in that backhand. And he got it back into play. Incredible. Sonego is not out of this by a long shot. And Both the of these ball. players Come and on. the crowd loved that. They absolutely loved that. He is not letting the crowd down here tonight. He's giving it his all. You can't ask for anything more. Look at that backhand. He was on the stretch. He dug it back in. Team should have really just finished that off, and he went for the drop shot again. The drop shot's been uh, not working for him too well tonight, Dominic yeah. team. I think he needs to just go with what got you to the dance. Hit those big winners. All right, 4-2. Another serve here for Lorenzo Sonego. The winners, 32 for Sonego, 23 for team in this match so far. So, Ooh, Sonego. He's, he's flipped it a lot, hasn't he, team? Yeah. 32. So, he's had nearly 10 more winners for Sonego in this matchup. 4-2. Oh, a crazy wild first serve. He was going for that one out wide, but he hooked it outside the tram lines. Second serve, everybody waiting with bated breath. Team loops the return back in. Great winner from Sonego. Come on, come on. He's keeping it alive. He's keeping wow. the Italian dream alive. Obviously, the last Italian left in the Rome Masters this what year. Shot. He's what doing it for Berrettini. He's doing it for Massetti. Look, Sonego's still there, and he's 4-3 down in this tie break. But it's in the balance. That's incredible. It's in the balance. Reminds one me, little mini break. Remiss, uh, no, I was going to say, it reminds me of the shots he was playing against Djokovic when he beat him. Those short angled winners. Incredible. Oh, bad serve for team. Second serve. The crowd's oh, getting on his crowd, back a little yeah, bit. The crowd can't keep quiet. Oh, it hit the line. Team forehand. Sonego forehand cross court. Team's gone with a drop shot again. Why? And now he's gone with this terrible lob. He smashed it away. Come on now, Sonego, he's back. He's back. He's for all. Two terrible shots from team. Sonego let him off the first one, but he's not letting him off the second. 
Why the drop shot? And the shot? Italian's back. The Italian is back. Why the drop shot again? Stop the it's drop. A terrible drop shot. shot. Drop shot of it. <laughs> yeah. Stop shot. <laughs> Man, I need to turn my volume up. It's getting tasty. <laughs> volume. I feel like I'm there in the stands. Oh, drive volley's gone out the backhand. Oh, it's just wide. Oh, imagine if that had flown in, mate. He needed it as well. It was so close. I feel like mate, he wanted that one again, mate. If he takes that again, he takes it. I just want to say we've got it. over 300 people here. Please, guys, if you haven't already, hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. We're going to be doing more live watch alongs tomorrow, and then weekend we've got semi-final and final action yeah mate it's really hotting up it's incredible we're nearly 100 likes on the video thanks to everyone who has liked it let's get it over that 100 likes it is 5-4 team on serve in the second set tie break big serve good return from team oh it's hit the baseline and he's got set point I don't think Sonego can believe it. It came back so fast. Yeah, it was a brilliant return. I can't believe it either. Dominic team with a bullet of a return, clips the baseline, and now he's got set shocked. point. I'm not going to lie, mate. I thought the serve was out and the return was out. <laughs> Both were called in. Yeah, I wasn't sure either. I don't feel like this is fair, person. I think Sonego has been good value for this set. And he finds wow. himself now. This is his fourth set point he's made. team serve it out. You hear the sirens in the distance. It's a fault. Those distinctive sirens in Italy. Oh, you can hear them in the background. Second serve, Sonego. Dominic team. There's, it's, you can hear a pin drop in there. It's crazy how silent everyone's become. Dominic team. Forehand looped it up. Sonego's gone for the big forehand <gasps> cross court. He's gone. Behind team winner oh, from it's so good. It's so good. This guy knows how to make a spectacle, and the shots he picks are so special. I loved how he went behind Dominic team there. He's slowly becoming one of my favorite players to watch. Oh, Sonego. I think he's such an interesting, uh, he's incredible. Yeah, he's a great guy. If you ever get the privilege of watching this guy live, I highly recommend it. Highly entertaining. Batista Agut back into the match in the other match. He is now two all in that matchup in the second set. Rublev won the first, but Dominic team serving. Got one point to get it done. He's missed the first serve. He's got second serve. It could only be this way, couldn't it? Yeah, we've could got Liam Holdaway in the chat. He's going, let's go, Sonny. Obviously a big fan of the Italians. It's in. Second serve. Finds it cross in. Court. He's gone cross court. Backhand from Sonego. Team big forehand. Sonego on the run. Down the line. Sonego's dug it out. It's long. And oh. team gets the second set. Let's go. Let's go. Dominic team. <laughs> Boom. I'm oh, going to the shop gosh. quickly, mate. You yeah. can take these guys. Just the... like that. We're going to be going to three. We've had two hours, 16 minutes of this one. And I feel terrible, personally, because Lorenzo Sonego, I feel like he deserved that match in two sets. He's been playing epic. However, Dominic team won't go away. And in some big pressure moments there, he showed why he's number four in the world. He showed why he's a Grand Slam champion. In Rome as well, in Italy, he's taken it to Lorenzo Sonego's backyard and he's forced it to three. Uh, let us know, guys, in the chat, what do you think for this third set? Do we have some predictions? Andrea's going six love now in the third set. Not sure if he really believes that. I don't think it's going to be a one-sided one. Uh, however, saying that, one thing I would say is that in the last match uh, team played, let me get it up. Because it's actually quite reminiscent of this one. So the last one he played against Martin Fuksovic, it ended 2-1 team. He lost the first set 6-3. He then won the second set in the tie break, 7-5. So very similar to this, obviously. Um, and then the third set, he got it done in 30 minutes and won six love. And I'm not sure what's going on here, but all the crowd seem to be leaving and booing. Is it raining there? The players have gone off the court. 
Does anyone know what's going on here? Play suspended. Has Dominic team withdrawn? I'm not sure. I think I think team has just pulled out of the match. Is that true? I'm going to have to look on uh, on the score thing here. Unless it's rain. I'm not sure. It could potentially be rain in there in Rome, which would mean that play would be suspended and uh, it will come back later on. It doesn't look like he had an injury, so I'm pretty sure that play has been suspended. Oh, the, the, okay. Sorry. So the crowd is leaving because of the curfew. Okay. Thanks for that, guys. So it's curfew time in Rome. So they're going to evict the crowd and get all the crowd out. So what is the time then? Is it 9.30 then in Rome that they have to evict the, the stadium of the players and stuff? Does anyone know what time the match is going to continue? Or will it continue now tomorrow? <laughs> this is very weird, I must admit. You can see the players, they're walking outside unless they go into another court to continue. I'm unsure what is going on, I must admit. <laughs> so yeah, very, very interesting scenes, I must admit. I'm not sure what's going to be happening. I will update you as soon as I know. Um, we've got Federico saying, I think they'll continue to play. Maybe they're just going to another court. It looks like they are. That's what's happening. So they're going to go to another court. Play is going to continue. They're just going to, st with, the, with the COVID, they're not sure what's going on. Yeah. Parlon saying, I'm not, I don't really get it. I must admit, I've not seen this happen before. Uh, we've got John saying the match is going to resume in 10 minutes. So that's good. You can see there. Yeah. Look, there's a, there's a, they're in the, on the other court now. So. Everyone's been evicted there. It's COVID curfew time. So I think we've got about 10 minutes until the action's got underway again. Uh, in the meantime, let's have a look at some of the other matches going on. We've got Vrublev playing against Batista Agut right now. Um, maybe I can get them scores up in the meantime, just to show you what's going on. Or maybe I'll leave it off. I'll just tell you what's happening. So Rublev, he won the first set 6-4. And then Batista Agut, he's leading 3-2. But Rublev, 40 love up. So potentially it's going to go 3 all. All to play for, really. Um, and the winner of that will be playing the winner of this one. So, obviously, we've got third set here between Dominic Team and Sonego. And the winner will be getting either Andre Rublev, the guy who's in top form right now, or Batista Agut, another good clay court player. A uh, good player on hard as well. Obviously, experienced been on the tour for a while. So, either of them are going to be a really tough, stern test. Uh, we've got 12 Travel 21 saying apparently they're going to be coming back in about 5 10 minutes. What's that uh, happened? It happened, it happened to Djokovic versus <laughs> Fritz, I think, after the fourth set. Mate, what? you didn't have to run. You've got time. So oh. it's hurt. I didn't know what was going on. I thought someone might have retired. Or it's apparently this happens every night now. There's a COVID uh, curfew time in Rome. So they get all the fans out of the stadium and it looks like they're Perfect. moving play to another stadium and it will be played in about 10 minutes' time. So. Oh, awesome. So he will be playing against no fans now. So that's yeah. perfect for Dominic team. Yeah. So the fat, the fan element's gone. I'm not sure if this is a good idea because if they're now going to be playing on a different court, unless they're going to come back to this court and play. Um, no, mate. just feel bad they didn't tell me that before I ran to the shop. Apparently they've been doing it every night. I didn't even know. We've got Sergio asking why is it interrupted. It's it's, it's a curfew time in Rome. It's I think it, it must be at 9.30 p.m. there because it's 8.30 here in the UK. Is that interrupted due to darkness? I think that's the reason. There's lights on the court. Yeah, no, it's not It's not because of darkness. Why does it say that on the thing? I don't know. So I'm just a bit out of breath. Did you, let's look through some of the stats. Yeah, yeah, go for it, mate. Oh, sorry, I was just going to catch my breath. I don't think I run, so just my <laughs> girlfriend just said, what I, did you fly to the shop and back? Mate, that was pretty quick, I must admit. I wasn't oh. expect I always expect you to be gone for about 15, 20 minutes. Mate, I literally ran. That, that guy who runs the shop is uh, very funny. He's like, he always sees me run in there and then run back out again. And he's just like, well, he's like, you're running again. I was like, Yeah, yeah, I'm in the middle of a live <laughs> live match. 
So maybe I'll get him subscribed, mate. Get uh, <laughs> him on the stream, mate. <laughs> that's it, mate. Maybe I'll take you take you down the shop next time with me. But yeah, as you can see there, the aces big. Uh, really, seven for Sanago, five for Dominic Team. Not bad. Dominic Team really uh, brushed up on his serving towards the end of that set. Really helped him. I think it was very, very promising stuff from Team. In I'm going to look on Twitter see what people are saying about this because it's very weird. How come uh, Rublev and Agut are still playing them? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Unreal stuff. Team suspended in the end of the set as the crowd uh, to respect the curfew in Rome. Yeah, that's why it's been done. Oh, okay. Well, maybe there's no people they're watching gonna, the other They're match. still going to come play, <laughs> but it's going to be at least 10 minutes suspension. Okay, well, mate, maybe we'll move over to Rublev's match then. We'll talk about that. Yeah. Just while we're uh, in the in the break. Sorry, I'll just ping it up there. Yeah, I'm going to just quickly uh, nip off. I didn't actually go to the toilet before. I was charging the thing, so... Yeah, I know you now. were. <laughs> I don't think everybody else did, though. Anyway, just going to have a quick look at Andre Rublev's match here with Batista Agur. <laughs> nah, yeah, Ranja, it's not actually because of darkness. It's just because of this curfew. Yeah, so are you saying that this one's also stopping? Oh, well, that's not too good. That's probably why the score's stuck. Well, we're, I'm going to go over and have a quick look at that uh, at that matchup, see what's going on over there, see if there's any more activity on the court at least. I'm guessing it's going to be a similar scenario like you just said. Uh no, they're going back out on court on the other one. So, and there's still fans on the other court. So, I'm not sure what's going on. Yeah, it's just suspended at the moment. Don't worry, it's coming back on. Team Sonego will be starting again on another court, apparently, in about 10 minutes' time. We're just going to, whilst that one is going to go back to, well, it's not due to darkness, Omri. It's due to the, the lockdown restrictions. They're having to get other people, get the people out. They're playing on a court with floodlit, so it's not darkness. The match will resume in about 10 minutes. Yeah, yeah, it says it's due to darkness. It's not. But anyway, move on to this match just for the time being because it's a very competitive uh, matchup at the moment. Rublev was trying to sort of have it all of his own way. But unfortunately, Batista wasn't really having it. He was... He was a breakup in the second set, and Batista has come back. So Andre Rublev is quite an even match now. Love 15 on Rublev's serve. Haven't seen any of this match so far, guys, so I can only tell you about how they're playing at the moment. They're going backhand to forehand, Rublev bringing out, oh, man, wow, what a winner down the line from Batista Agut. He's turning it on by the looks of it, and what a time to do so. He would be serving for this second set if he is to uh, if he was to win this game. Very, very good performance from Batista Agut to uh, come back from where he is. Uh, he was obviously a set and a breakdown. Uh, Drew saying, when do they play again? They will be playing again in about 10 minutes' time. So hang with the stream. Uh, just stay here. We're just going to cover Rublev and Batista are good just whilst they're in the changeover uh, before Any they get underway. What's again. going on? <laughs> no, there's nothing at the moment. Uh, they've just cleared the stands at the moment. So I'm guessing they're just going to be back on court in a little bit. But at the moment, there's still fans on the court for Rublev are good, and they're still playing. So we'll cover this one just for the time being. Anything on Twitter? No, I can't see anything, mate. I'm just having a little scroll now. Seems to be a, a very weird thing to happen. And obviously, we've been doing this for a bit now. It's never happened when we've had one, but obviously it's due to COVID, it seems. Well, I think they've stopped it there because it's the end of a set. And whereas Rublev and Agut are, uh, are still right in the, in the middle of their set, they're probably going to wait until a more appropriate time to, to do it on their court, I would have thought. Well, anyway, Batista are good playing really well at the moment. 
Uh, some of the forehands he's hitting back behind Andre Rublev. And there's another one out to the Rublev forehand. He's keeping him guessing. And Rublev, big winner down the line from Andre Rublev, though, on the backhand side. Fantastic. Yeah, I agree with Midfield Marshall. He's insane racket head speed. There you go. Look. <laughs> 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 nice, you didn't know man. I could do that, could did you? Yeah, that doesn't look the most pretty, I have to say. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you make it a ticker? That's probably better. <laughs> well, you just you just have to press the button. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Match suspended due to well, say which match. <laughs> well, they know they're clicking on the match. All right, People sure. are probably clicking on this thinking, what's happening with Team Sonego? That's what's happening. You've got it all there. Yeah. At the moment, Andre Rublev is locked in a very, very tough rally. At the moment, Batista Agut is trying to grind him down. But there you go. Andre Rublev injects the pace. And injecting the pace, won him the point. It's a very, very hard-fought game at the moment, this one. Yeah. Uh, let us know what you think. Hey, we've got Parlons in there with a bit of Rublev. Uh, <laughs> He's doing every one, yeah. by looks of it. <laughs> let us know. <laughs> How do you think that match is going to go? How do you think Rublev is going to get on? Do you think he's going to close out in two? Or do you think Batista Agut is going to uh, continue this impressive comeback? And there you go. He holds. Huge, uh, I'm going to have a look at the bracket. I want to see what, who I had for this one. I think you have Rublev. Did I? Well, yeah, I think they're asking... Well, I don't know if they're asking the fans to leave, but there's a lot of people booing in between the... Oh, no, yeah. I think they're stopping the match now. Yeah, they're yeah, going to yeah. stop this one and ask the fans to leave on this court now yeah, as yeah. well. And uh, I've just stuck the uh, tennis draw challenge in the live chat. If anyone wants to join our league in there, it's completely free and we will be giving you prizes away. So you get to test your tennis knowledge for every tournament on the men and women's tour. Uh, you can do your own bracket where you can fill in the tournament and see who you have as the winner. And you're competing against me and Ben, everyone else in the GTL community. It's a bit of fun. And uh, yeah, we will be giving prizes to the winners. So good luck in that. And hopefully you can join. I think you just got to put your email address in when you sign up. Hit the link. And uh, yeah, it'd be great to see you on there. It would indeed. I was going to say, whilst we've got this little break, uh, maybe we could give a few more people who haven't seen the podcast an opportunity to uh, have a go at Game of Faces, which is the new game on the Game to Love channel. Yeah. There is a well, I'll show you the rules and then I can sort of try and uh, explain it as we go. But hey, as that, what better time than an interruption play? Let's play the game of faces. Time to face the game. It's the game of the faces. Time to face the game. That's right. It's the game of faces. Right, yes. I mean, yeah, well, let's play the game of faces for now. I'll explain to you how it works. There is a competition run at the moment. The results will be revealed early next week. So this is uh, how it works. There's the hair is somebody. The eyes are somebody. These are all ATP top 100 players. The nose and cheeks are somebody. The mouth and the chin is somebody else. And then just the ears and the rest of the body and torso See if you can guess all of these different five players. I mean, I can pop it up on the screen for you guys again. Let me just pop the uh, little banner up just in case anyone joins in, wonders what's uh, going on. But, mate, yeah, I think it's a good opportunity. Leave us your answers in, uh, well, either in our Discord chat or send some in in the live chat as well. well let me uh, hear your guesses on who you think this player is made up of. But let me just try and find it. I, this is all very uh, last minute. Yeah, we've got so. D Chinga asking, are they playing or not? Yeah, they will be playing. It's just been uh, suspended for the moment uh, due to the COVID curfew in Rome. Exactly. So whilst we have this curfew, see if you can name who this, these, this player is made up of. It is all players inside the top 100. Uh, you've got the hair, you've got the eyes, the nose and cheeks, the mouth and chin. And the ears and body. I mean, we had this has been out for a few days now. So if you know the answers, either send it in the Discord chat or send it in the live chat or write it in the comments after the video has ended. So if you know the answer, if you get all five correct 
And there's other, if you're the only one, you'll win a prize. If there's more than one person, you'll draw the winner from a hat. So and that will be done early next week on next week's podcast. So, but yeah, take a good look. And how do you <laughs> enter, Ben? Well, you can enter by writing it in the live chat right now if you want to. Tell us your five picks. I can go back through and uh, have a look to see, or I can I can look as you're going through, and I can I can write your name down if you get them all right. But you'll only hear the results early next week on our first podcast of next week. Yeah. So we the match is resuming between Batista and Gut and Rublev. So yeah, if you want to rewind this video and have a look at that again. Be my guest, but I'm going to put the score back up for Batista Agut and Andre Rublev. No, you mean the other one? No, because the other one isn't on yet. Okay, this one's great. back on the court. They've cleared all the fans off and they've just started playing again. I don't know why Dominic Team and Sonego get to be off court for a, however long. They've been off court for a good, like, what, 15 minutes now? 15, 20, yeah. It's been a while, it seems. You nipped to the shop in time. <laughs> I was just there like, what's going on? Mate, I was that's thinking, brilliant. oh no, what's happening now? I thought it was, um, I thought at one stage team retired because he had someone coming over to him talking. I was like, what's going on? I know. We came over and just said, look, it's been your best interest just to retire. Otherwise all these Italians <laughs> are going to storm on the court. And He's just been threatened. <laughs> Yeah, we've got the mafia in the crowd today, <laughs> and they've said you've lost the match. <laughs> but your bank account is very healthy right now. <laughs> it looks like we're underway now um, in this big match against Team versus Sanego. Team to serve. Uh, it's for a third. So I think they're just going to have a little hit, just a little warm up. Yeah, I think that's best. Can't just go off and then just go straight back on. They went off for longer than like Rublev and. Batista Agu had gone straight back into it, but they weren't off for very long. Yeah. You can see so. there, there you go. Time since last point. It's been 18 minutes, 50 seconds. So, yeah, what we said, 15, 20 minutes was about right. Well, there you go. Yeah, it's not started again just yet, We've got guys. a pick in here from Kaylee Ben. We've got Team Hair, Davidovic Eyes, Sitter Pass Nose and Cheeks, Anderson Chin, uh, and Tomic Ears and Body. Pretty yeah, close. It's been very. There's a lot of people picking the Anderson chin, mate. I think uh, it might be a good one. That one. I don't know. <laughs> got Magdi going for Crane O'Hare, Sinner Eyes and Chin, uh, Nose and Cheek, Apelka, and Rafa Ears. You're close on it. I like the fact that you've gone down on the eyes on that one because obviously you've got like a bit, a bit like a fair, fair eyebrows. So keep along those lines, and you'll be on the on the right uh, on the right track. But when's when's this other match kicking off? I reckon it'll be soon. Yeah, time since last point, 19 minutes. Rublev looks like he's going to break against a gut, 30 or well, yeah. not going to, he's threatening the break. Oh, great shot there from a gut though. Great volleying. Rublev give it, oh, fantastic. He's got break point. Yeah. Passing shot too good. Well, I'm not sure what's going on. My other stream doesn't seem to be even working. I don't know why. No, I'm maybe watching it. Which one? It's the team. Maybe it's because I've got the other one on and it's messing yeah. everything up. I think it'll just be a five-minute warm-up and then they're just practicing some serves now, warming up. It's been 20 minutes since the last point. We're going to be going into a third set. I don't know if you want to put the scores up maybe for this one. Yeah, I mean, it's not started yet, but yeah, I guess we can. And it just says interrupted due to darkness, which is confusing <laughs> to everyone. That's why I took it off. <laughs> <laughs> why did they do that they just made it up <laughs> yeah i know i don't, they do I, I weird... don't know what they, i don't think they knew they just thought oh, it must be because it's dark <laughs> they do weird stuff like that on uh on those scores sometimes they just put up a random thing interrupted due to darkness there we go <laughs> rublev breaks he's going to be serving wow. now for the match what a time to break What's your predictions now for this set who's this going to affect as well we've not spoke about it well, this little break it's just going to be disrupt... Yeah, I think it will disrupt. Well, there's no fans in there, so that's one thing that's going to go against him. There you go. I think that might help him as well, though, because think of all the pressure, all those hundreds of people all there just hoping he'll win. Now, not so much pressure. They might be waiting for him outside the stadium, though, so he might want to uh, get that done. We've got that's... Naveen going nose and cheek Jamie Murray. Yeah, there's a lot of people saying Jamie Murray. They're in the ATP Top 100, all five players, so that's the clue. I don't think Jamie Murray's in there. Not even a singles, yeah? yeah, yeah, singles. 
So, yeah, you've got 100 players to pick from. There we go. Looks like they're going to get ready, Ben. Yeah, mate, my stream's not working for it for some reason, but I'll get so, you. So there you go, just problem. having a little drink. Having a little and drink. I'm not sure who's going to be serving first. I yeah, think Senego, some... maybe. Senego yeah. to serve first. You've got Charing Bot saying, do you think no fans is going to help team? Quite possibly, but ultimately it's going to be down to the, how they're playing. And I think this little break might help Senego because team was finding his rhythm. If team goes back to playing like he did in the first set in spells, then senego has got a real chance here in this third set. Well, oh, mate, oh, my stream's like not running at all. It just keeps stopping. No idea why. That's weird. Might be the internet. Yeah. No idea, mate. I haven't had any problems up until now, up until that he stopped. <laughs> they interrupted the stream. So I maybe I'm going to have to swap device. Oh, great start for Sonego. 15 love. First oh. point of the stoppage. It's been over 20 minutes, but we're back underway again. Sonego with the first point. The match has resumed, guys. The match is back. The match was interrupted because of COVID curfews in Rome and they had to evict all of the fans. They had a little 10-minute or 15-minute break or 20 minutes it turns into. And now we're back underway in the third. Sonego looking good and he's 30 love up. Indeed, mate. I'm it's not seem to have phased him too much. I don't think it would. I think it'll help him reset on the service uh, side of things, especially especially the fact it's beginning of a set again. The pressure comes off. Uh, he's going to be... Yeah, your I score's think... aren't updating either, mate, so it might be the internet. Mm, I think that's flash, mate, because the scores on the other one's updating fine. It's... Big serve there. 40 love for people who are watching. Sonego serving in this third set and he's up for 40 love right now. Yeah, I don't know what, I, what else I can uh, change unless I just try and get the no, score. It's, no, the... It's, it's flash, mate. It's fine. Just wait a sec. I'm sure it'll update in a bit. Unfortunately, the scoreboard's having a few issues. Obviously, uh, the game got interrupted. I think it's probably to do with that more than anything. Yeah, I think somebody, whoever's in charge of the score, didn't get... They got, they, a kit. Out, they got told to get out of the stadium. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. They can't put the score on. The umpires got kicked out as well. There we go. He holds. It's a game to love as well wow. for Sonego. Impressive. Right. I'm got another stream up, mate. Don't worry. I'm full of different screens and streams and <laughs> different bits That's and good. pieces. The match is underway, guys. Uh, there we go. The score's just updated. Tanae goes one love up in this third set. One love. with a game to love. And team has not won a point since the stoppage in play. Oh, no. Here we go. So. <laughs> he's not won a single point. And Shocking. Rublev, on the other hand, he's got match point against the Gurt. He's already had one uh, save, though. Shock, shock, horror, as they say. Was this done as a ploy by the Italians to help Sonego win? Ah, what? So that as soon as you lost the set, like, right, clear the stands. <laughs> Let's create not... uh, uh, Oh, I don't like the uh, the court looks terrible at the moment, though. Why have they not sorted the court out at least? <laughs> they normally <laughs> like sweep it at the end of the set, yeah. don't they? Yeah, yeah. They haven't even bothered. Break it. It looks like, if anything, they've gone on and made it worse. <laughs> <laughs> looks terrible. Sabotage. Oh, Bru Andre Rublev threw in straight set six four six four. Well done to him. He'll be. Pe uh... People are still asking in the chat why it's interrupted. It's like we've put it on the it's... screen as well. Oh. Like we've said it a million times. And Rublev wins. Well done to Rublev. Straight set six four six four. Yeah. Team fifteen love in this third set. He's down one love, but we're on serve. The winner of this will be playing Rublev. Whoa. Great, he hit the line there. Good smash. Sonego gets the smash back, does he? No, just lands Not just short one. of the net. Just short of the net. God, it's been a bit First of a monster of a match, mate, for us. A massive. That's why I said, mate, it said all the makings to be even more epic than the Rafa Chapo match. You had the Italian stallion playing, the last Italian person in the competition. But they, they've kicked all the fans out. <laughs> Not doing him any favours. 
Good return there from Sonego. Goes cross court. Team cross court forehand. Sonego, big forehand winner down Come the line. Come on, there we go. First yeah. time we've seen an actual proper winner since the stoppage. It's going to take a while for the players to get back into the rhythm. Obviously, that the back yeah. end of the second set, the quality was through the roof. Both of them playing so well. Um, but right now, it's a bit... It's gone off the boil slightly. It's like the match has just restarted Ooh. again. Yeah. Man, I just think I feel a bit bad for team, to be to be honest. That was like the worst possible uh, time. I think it still affects Sonego as well because he's got to start finding his rhythm again as well. Yeah, but he started better. In the, that's why I normally benefits the person who's the quicker starter. And Sonego was the quicker starter in this match. That's why if you had the rhythm and you just won the set, you've got all the momentum. And look at that. Another winner from Sonego. Now he's hitting the ball cleaner than you've seen him hit it for possibly yeah. the last two or three games. Yeah, we've got Pablo saying it's incredible how constant you guys are. Thanks. Yeah, well, if you want to give a, give your thanks, please leave us a like on this video. It really does help us out. And if you're new to the channel, you just stumbled across us, hey, welcome and hit the subscribe button. Yeah, share, hit the share button as well and share us with any of your other friends who love tennis, even if they don't love tennis and just want to hang out and listen to us talk about tennis. <laughs> Get, bring them in as well. Juice. So now you go threatening Dude. the break right now. Indeed. MC said, what's happened to the court? Yeah, it looks very weird. It didn't look that oh, bad yeah. before, did it? I don't know why they haven't raked the court. They no, normally... but it didn't look that bad before. <laughs> no, it looks terrible now. <laughs> it looks like they, they put water on it, but didn't rake it. Oh, really deep shot there from Sonego. He's got yeah. team penned back into the corner. Oh, good inside out forehand by Dominic Team. Good slice there from Sonego. It's too good. It works. Got it's break, break point. point. Break point, Sonego. Come on. This is bad for Dominic Team. Just what he didn't need. The break in play has affected him in an adverse way. And he's facing break point early on. All the momentum has been lost, it would seem. Oh, they say it's a late well. call, that. They're going well, to have a look at it. much about tennis, but he bets on tennis. Let us know, who did you pick on this one? Are you going for team or Sonego? Yeah, be interesting. Did you go with the home countryman? Or... Yeah, it's out. Yeah, yeah, clearly. Oh, good return. Good depth on it. Sonego goes inside out forehand. Team goes big backhand down the line. Sonego answers with a big oh, forehand cross court. It's too good. Come on. There we go. Sonego breaks in this third and final set. Wow. Just I think it's like button that. time. Wow. The pizza's Sorry. out, the pizza's out, and Sonego's broken. He leads now to love in this deciding set, but can he consolidate the break? What can I say, mate? Team looks Looking... so angry. I'm not surprised, but he's just, he's not playing his best tennis, and everything he does here at Sonego, it comes back at him with interest. So, it's credit to Sonego. He, he's benefited now from this little break. Oh, good return from team. He's gone into the Sonego backhand. Look at the recovery from Sonego, though. He's getting everything back in court right now. He seems re-energized. Oh. oh, great yeah, shot back. from team. Wow, that was great from Dominic team there. Sonego's but, back. He's yeah, playing mate, so well. Playing incredibly well. Dominic team, it's just, he looks in pain on his face. Doesn't seem happy at all. And Sonego gliding around the court looks as fresh as ever right now. Yeah. It looks like we've got a few gamblers in the chat. We've got Parlon saying 2.62 for team. That's got to be a bet. If anyone wants <laughs> to bet and help get Jane, uh, game to love, check out our description. We have a sponsor, BetUS. If you sign up there, you get 100% bonus. Um, and it'd be great to have you on board with it. Obviously, it's good to start off with. You get a nice start, I bet. Um, yep. And you can make some money off the bat. Oh, he's hit that one long. There was no need. Went for all power and no accuracy there, Sonego. Sacrificed the accuracy, and now he finds himself 
in a bad position. Love 30, but he does have a big serve, so he could get himself out the hole, I'm sure. Yeah, it's still not good, though, is it? No, He's not been not... threatened too much on his serve, and now he finds himself love 30. Does indeed. Big serve. Dominic team returns it. Sonego. Oh, he's hit the line there. It's great. Great slice there. He's into the net. Sonego hits the volley. Dominic team's in. He goes for the lob. He smashes it away. Well played. There's still enough people there to give him a good clap. 15-30. James is saying the betting link doesn't work. Oh, sorry. I'll get Ben to uh, fix that one. <laughs> I know where it is, mate. I don't have it to hand. What's that? The, the link? Yeah, maybe it's it. on that. Uh, I can get it actually. All right. Laptop. Nice one. So 15, 15, 15, 15, 30. Lorenzo Sonego doesn't want to give a break straight back to Dominic Team. Big serve. Dominic Team, great return on the backhand. He goes back behind him. He goes slice. As Sonego attacks the net. Good volley. Good backhand volley. Team goes slice. Sonego backhand into team's forehand. Now they're going cross court. Team's backhand. Not with any venom at all, though. Now he's backpedaling. He goes long, long on the backhand from team. And he is bent double there, looking at the floor, not happy with himself at all. Yeah, he looks like he's struggling a bit there. I don't know if it's just, I don't know if it's fatigue, if it's just mental fatigue, frustration. There's something not going right for him. Yeah, He's if you happy. try the link now, it should work. Let me know if it don't. Apologies about that. Sonego serving 30 all. He's back in this game. It's just wide and he's, he's he wants the umpire to go check that one. Did look close, but the umpire's not moving. <laughs> He's just saying it's out. He's trusting it. Second serve. Second serve down the middle. Dominic team returns. Goes into the net and we got break point. Sonego poor that time. He tried to hook it back over the top of the net, but got it all wrong, really. Both players hitting a bit of patchy form now on their shots. Interesting. Break point team. Yeah, break point, mate. And break points one, two out of ten there. That's for Sonego. What team's not broken him yet, is it? Nope. Only in the tie break, just the mini break. <laughs> Big serve down the tee. Team returns, gets it back into play. And again, close to the baseline. It's long and he breaks straight back. Well, poor hitting there from Sonego. Yeah, a bit poor there from Sonego. He he just wasn't moving his feet quite as well. Just got caught under his feet and a bit of a shank, really. Disappointing. He, he's done the break. What are you doing? Throwing it away so easily. He's not been broken all match. I think that's a poor mentality, a bit weak. Yeah, and now he's got the well, banana that's... out. Just going to see if that gives him a little bit of energy. Maybe he's just lacking a little bit of energy. There's no What's... way you need to get broken straight back there. Come on, need a bit more resilient. I know, but then you've got to think what's going through his mind when you get to this stage of the match as well. You just broke him, probably thinking the end is in sight now. Or maybe I'm going through to the next round. Who am I playing in the next round? You can't think that far ahead against Dominic Team. Dominic Team is definitely in with a chance still. He is back on serve in this third and final set. Uh, Deepak asking whose serve is best. Well, I would say Sonego's Sonego. has got the more powerful serve, but team's team... been more clutch on the serve. This is going to say exactly the same. Well done. So... <laughs> well done. <laughs> Was I right? Well, yeah, you are. <laughs> yeah, mate, MC now this... Quadro is saying, it seems to me that if Sonego cuts down the unforced errors, he can really win this match. Yes, yeah, he's kind of in his hands, I think. It is. Mate, the, the, the crowd is um, missing from this matchup now. It seems that the atmosphere has been sucked out of that arena in Rome. It was really rocking Yeah. Uh, in that second set. I kind of set. wish Sonego got it done in two now because this third set's been a bit flat. 
I know we've had a few breaks, but the mood's just been lifted after having all that break and then getting back into it. Difficult to really get up for something like that. And I think both players are reflecting it in their style of play as well. Yeah, it's going to... Yeah, they look been... prone to the break, not as confident with the serving. No crowd to play up to. No crowd. It's just gone a bit like exhibition, really. Shame to, for a big Masters event for them to be doing that. I think it's stupid. Well, it's what it is, and it's long from Sonego there. He laughs. Quality is coming down as well. He's hit a few long. He wasn't hitting these ones in the last set, and they were all flying in. Well, 15 love. Team looking to get back on level terms and to be level for the first time in a long time in this match. That one's, oh, just hit the, the tram line there. He's done well. He's gone with a drop shot. Team's in. Oh, great drop shot reply from yep. team. And Sonego didn't even bother moving for that. Too good. I'm going to have a little look at the bracket, see how that's getting on. <laughs> Why not? He's, he's done with the match now. <laughs> he's just yeah. veering off into all sorts of other... I can't. It's just it's got a bit too flat. I'm going to have to wait for the business end for me. Well, don't you um, worry, guys. It's not flat. It's <laughs> it's still going, mate, for me. I want Dominic team to do what I said. I said he was going to lose the first set and come back. Oh, it's close on the serve there. Just wide. Dominic team second serve. Sonego gets a little look in here. Oh, it's a double fault from Dominic team. Poor. The Deep quality is gone, mate. The quality is downhill. Do you think the crowd really matters to win the match. Mm, maybe. Oh. Uh, maybe a little bit. I think yeah. it was it was giving uh it was giving both players a little bit more impetus in in their shots. There seemed to be a lot more intensity in that stadium. Now Seems that they're both prone to a, a, an unforced error. Oh, good hitting from both players in this rally, though. Down the line from team. Cross court. Big backhand from team. Answered by Sonego. Team steps in with a big forehand. It's too good. 40-15. Couldn't control the power there. And that's good from Dominic team. Parlons I'm just looking at our bracket. The bracket leader is Saruk right now. Oh, and wow. he had... Uh, he has Rublev to win the whole thing, which is interesting. Ooh. Not many people have Rublev, but some of the predictions he's made in this is really good. I'll be honest. He had Hugo Delian to beat Manorino. I have he that. had Kanish Corey to beat Buster. I didn't know um, that. Buster was a walkover, though. Yeah, that's, that's true. Fair. He's not really got many wrong. He's done very well. Fair play. He had Sonego to beat uh, to Mega or Dimonor, sorry. So did I. Oh, did, did you have Sonego to get this far? Uh, I believe so, but going out, I think. No, I don't think I had him going this far. I, would, I had him I had him beating, yeah, I had him playing team and then going out to team. Yeah, oh, so. fair enough. So you did that, you did quite well as well. well. Let me have a look at your one then. <laughs> no, I didn't do so well. You go down. <laughs> that, that Schwartzman <laughs> section's complete garbage. And so is yeah, the Yeah, Dan Evans. I think I had that one as well. Yeah, Bublik to beat. Who? Silich. Who was? Oh yeah, Kasparu dropped out as well. Great, thanks. <laughs> so that I had Camille Mazgrazak as going through a few rounds. Yeah, this section's a tough one. I don't think anyone really got Delboni Sapelka, so it's not too bad. I think what ruined you is Fanini to beat Nishikori first round. Did I have that? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fanini to beat Nishikori, <laughs> and Nishikori's just because it was in Italy. Far. It was in Italy. I know. I was going. I was back in the Italians. How long have they been had. playing for? Says you had uh, pair. Um, you had pair to beat your I know. I thought he might turn up. <laughs> they didn't back the back the wrong Italian. It's wide from Sonego there, and it's love fifteen. But this time it's for Dominic team, not against him. Uh, they've been playing for two hours thirty nine minutes. I'm not sure if that's completely accurate because there was an interval. You have to take no. It is accurate. You need to take five minutes off it. Five. Yeah. Is it? Because it started five when they started warming up again. That's when it started ticking. Oh, okay. All right. I'll let you off. So, really, they've been playing two hours, 32 minutes or 30. Oh, good return from team. Big forehand. Team getting it back in play. Good volley in there from Sonego. Attack the net well. Oh, you got it there as well. Two hours, 36 they've been playing. Yeah. I need to sort out this court. <laughs> I hate looking at this court when it looks like this. It looks horrible. I don't know how oh, they've allowed them. It's easily going to go over three hours, this one. Yeah. 
but it seems longer than three hours because I feel like this match was scheduled for six o'clock uh, for the UK. It's now it's been three hours, 13 minutes since. So well, I feel like, like I've been sitting here for about three hours, 15, but then the game was not reflected that. I think it started oh, late. Chop, chop. He's into the net. He's down into the back end. So he's gone with a lob. Did he call it out himself? <laughs> it sounded like he no, it was it just out. out. <laughs> it sounded it's like Nago said, "Oh, <laughs> you got Roche." And what's your predictions for this match? I'll be honest, team wins from here. Hey, right. get off my score prediction. No, it's, if it may, if it goes to three sets, I said I don't see Sonego winning in three. All right, I'll let you off. He had to do it in the two sets. All right, calm. Anyway, you got Magdi saying, "All I've been doing is watching tennis today." And eating love, sweets, not bad. Love, love I've it. been working all day wow. and trying to watch tennis. <laughs> Big winner there from Sonego. Inside out, forehand, back behind team. Really impressive stuff. Can he just hold on here? That's what he needs to do. When it's not going your way, you just need to just dig out these Ooh. games and just hold serve. It's pretty close. <sighs> well, match winners, 40. For Sonego to 24 for team. So team not really hitting Magdi's many. Magdi's turned as well. Magdi's saying that team's going to win as well. Interesting. Well, the, there you go. And he's got break point. I think it is the wise pick, if I'm honest. 34. That second set was just so big. Massive. People Don't are People are asking, Paolo and El Pelcro Del Bonis tomorrow. Who you got? That's tough, mate. I'd say Del Bonis. But I think if Pelco continues the run, no, it's just if he serves well, he can have. If he has an off service game, then he loses. I think the Del Bonis has ever dealt with someone like that, mate. You'd be surprised, Del Bonis. I've I just had a weird feeling that he was going to win against Felix. But Why don't you put him in your bracket then? When no, did you have him in your bracket? I only had the feeling after I'd done the bracket. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I want to see what you've done. With it. Oh, you had, you had Hatchinoff beating him in the first round. <laughs> oh, it's long and he breaks. Dominic team. Yeah, Fantastic. like we were saying, looks like it could be over now for the young Italian. I feel terrible for him. He was looking so good. He it's had to take the opportunities in that second set. Still don't like this behaviour, wrapping it up at three two up in the middle of the I'm set. I'm not wrapping it up. I'm just being you. honest. I'm, I I'm saying in this third set, he had to do better early doors. Now he's allowed it to go to three. It's teams to lose. Team has the momentum. He's always he's good when he got, does this. He did the same thing against Martin Fuksovic. Lost I'm six not... three, won the tie break seven six, and then he won six love in the third. Ah, uh, mate, exactly. Well. If you if you were a betting man, today would have been probably a great day. If you'd have got on Rafa Nadal earlier, I think he was at three to one earlier on when he was down uh, a set and three yeah. love to Shapovalov. Uh, and if you got on Dominic Team earlier, he was uh, a set down as well. He you could have got him at I think two six two or something. Yeah. Set, we didn't see we? match point, did we? I think Sonego up a few points was like very close, like two points away. Two points away, yeah, yeah exactly. a few times. He just couldn't get the match point. Well, it's going to be interesting to see how this plays out. Obviously, the winner of this matchup will play Andre Rublev in the next round. What a lovely prize for whoever goes through. Uh, you're going to have uh, that nasty Russian who can power you off the court. Who do you think wins? Well, Rublev's probably going to be a favourite, I think. Yeah. I've got a feeling Rublev. he would be. I think Rublev beats team if it is team. It's close. It'd be close, but Rublev playing really well at the moment and he hits the ball hard. You know I'm going to be rooting for. Dominic team, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly, mate. I think in my bracket, I have the same scenario. I have team Rublev, but I've got Rublev. Oh, good serve there from team. Follows it up with a great shot. Yeah, he's coming to life a lot more now. And you can see him kind of ending this one. You've got Rada saying... Uh, Vuksanovic saying <laughs> Novak or Sitter pass. I think it's a trick question. I feel like he wants us to say Novak. Uh, well, I've got I think Novak. it's going to be a close one. Who do I have in the bracket? Novak. Yeah, I've got Novak in my bracket. If we had Sitter pass, nah, I've got Novak. I think I've got Sitter pass, so oh. yeah, it's a bold well, call. 
Sadipus. Who do you have uh, Djokovic going out to then? Um, it's in the it's a team, obviously. That'd be the semi. <laughs> If it goes on. No, mate, don't. <laughs> team, so this team's going to knock out Djokovic. No chance. Mate, well, I'm I'm banking on him getting better as the tournament goes on. That was the sort of the idea. Yeah, it's possible. Might be Senego again. <laughs> oh, it's long there from Dominic team. 30-15. He's like psyching himself up there. What's that? The little shoulders going. Hey, hey. Yeah, guys, I just want to say, we've got 240 people <laughs> sticking with us. Your troopers, like me, me and Ben are. I know. Really appreciate it. We've not had dinner or anything yet. No. Uh, but guys, if you want to help us out at all, give us a like on the video. <laughs> hit the subscribe button. It really does mean a lot. Uh, we're working hard. We've got Varit here saying, hey, I'm new here. How are you? Very well, thanks. Hit the, hit the subscribe Whoa. button if you're new. And they go into the net with after a good approach shot. He smashes it away and it's 30 all. <laughs> Midfield Marsh saying, surprise, surprise. Ben picks Djokovic to beat Sissipas. Yeah, boring but Ben. Let, but let me off because I picked him, team to beat him. Thank you. Boring Ben strikes again. Oh, who have you got winning the tournament? I just need to check on JG's bracket. Uh, <laughs> boring Ben Clay Clay strikes Clay. again. <laughs> it's uh oh, it's Rafael Nadal. Oh, shock! <laughs> oh, shock on Clay. Oh, that's never happened before. Well, why don't you pick it then? If you think it's going to happen, mate. Dominic team <laughs> struggling against Senego. Oh, it's long. <laughs> it's got break point. <laughs> Senego break point to get back into this match. Unfortunately, so, until the business ends happens, it's just kind of ruined the mood of the match for me. You've mate, got Michael back- asking, why do they leave the court? I feel like we've answered this about a million times already. But basically, there was a COVID... What's it called? What? I've even, what's the word? Why do they leave the court? A COVID curfew. curfew. Team goes forehand down the line. Sonego can only chop it long and he saves the break point. He needs to consolidate here. This is huge for Dominic team and his potential Rome Masters. He could win it. It's huge for my bracket. Sonego could win it. When was the last Italian to win the Rome Masters? That'd be a good question. Oh, does anyone know in the chat? I know we've got a lot of Italians here. Who was the last or has there ever been an Italian win the Rome Masters? Oh, good return there from Sonego. Slice cross court team. Great drop shot. Sonego's in. Can he pass him? It's good enough. The volley goes wide there yeah. from Sonego. And we've got game point instead. Even Consolidation team... point. <laughs> Is it just me? Or well, even when team wins the point, he goes. <laughs> he gets so very weird. angry i don't know why he wins the point and it's not like a fist bump but he just does the same as when he lost the point i don't get it he just goes away like oh god what's going on oh advantage dominic team big serve sonego good return slice cross court sonego big Oh, it's into the net and he consolidates. Come on, team. Big. Very big. Indeed. So in this deciding set, team leads 4-2. Can he get a double break here or will Sonego still fight back? Yeah, it's interesting to see. Obviously, along the bottom of the screen running at the moment, team's name nowhere to be seen in the race for Turin at the moment. Yeah. Not even in that. Well, he's not, he's not done anything. Mate, why have you changed it to that one again? I like it. I like seeing, <laughs> I like seeing who's. <laughs> he's obsessed. Spanos Sadipus. Rublev's going to keep pushing on there as well. Daniel Medvedev. He's at number four. Karatsev there at six. Can he so stay we've got, in? Uh, here we go. The last Italian winner of Rome is Adrian, Ad- Adriano Panata in the late 1970s. Beast of a player. Ooh. Do you remember him? No. There you go. 12 travels. I thought you were going to say you was there. I was. I thought I was going to say you were related to him. <laughs> <laughs> Your grandfather. Ben was going to like, oh, I remember that one. That was a fine day. It was, it was a sunny black. day in Rome. It was all in black and white back then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's into the net. Easy, easy service game for Sonego so far. 30 love putting the pressure back on team. The pressure is on. The heat is on. Dun, dun, 
Dun, dun, dun. The heat is definitely on. So probably a lot hotter in Rome than it was in England here today. Awful downpours. I hope the weather doesn't make it over there to Rome. Yeah, for the middle of May, it's a pretty atrocious the weather here at the moment. Today. Mate, I had the lights on from the whole day because it was so dark. It's Awful. dark already now. It's horrible. Well, I guess it is because it's so late. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I've been in here all day. <laughs> hey, I haven't even moved from this seat since this morning at nine. I've gotten I've so in... hungry that now I'm not hungry. Does that make Game sense? There we go. Game to love, Sonego. Pressure back on team. Oh, and we got someone wanting a team win there can win 200 euros. Oh, nice one. Sally going, me too. Let's go team. Everyone's, there's, all the team fans have come out now. I don't know where all the yeah. Italians have gone. There were so many Italians earlier there was. in that tie break. I think the so Italians I'm... have gone for dinner. But... Well, probably not. It's probably, t- <laughs> probably gone to bed. Nah, time, mate, it? it's, this is, mate, they don't go to bed this early. You know, the dinner pro in Italy probably lasts for about six hours. <laughs> you know what it's like probably there Rashan probably... saying if Sonego wins I win 5k USD wow Wow. hopefully we get a k of that at least I'll take well, two sorry Rashan because <laughs> I want team to win I think you should have cashed out after the uh, first set 12 troubles <laughs> why don't you stock up <laughs> On carb gels to snack on. That's what endurance athletes do. This should not be an endurance affair well, doing these I feel podcasts. Like I, I ran to the shop and back. That's as much exercise as I've had all day. I've walked to the kitchen to make lunch and came back to the seat again. And that was eight hours ago. And yeah. I've been in this seat for the last eight hours. I don't think, I'm an Italian I, in England, but I know team would take this. Yeah, agreed. I'm half Italian. I would want it to to win. You see how much I was cheering him on. I'm just kind of defeated at the moment. I think team doesn't lose from this position. I think I need to start Ben's new chair fund on GTL. <laughs> I can't sit in this chair anymore. It does me in. My whole body's numb. Just get a new chair. I'll buy you one. Ah, oh, nice one. Look at that. It's that Italian mafia money coming <laughs> through. No, I'll buy it for my Bitcoin money. Bitcoin, oh, mate, that's gone down the pan. Elon Musk's <laughs> pulled out. <laughs> Uh, every share in the market's down. <clears throat> right, I'm not talking about that now. 4-3, <laughs> Dominic team. I don't want to cry on the stream. <laughs> Big loop in forehand from team. Playing it down the middle of the court. Sonego goes out to team's forehand. Big forehand. Big forehand by Sonego. Team loops his backhand. Big forehand by team down the line. Cross court Sonego. They both go cross court. Team just loops into the middle. Big long rally, this one. Oh, finished with a drop shot by team. Don't know if he meant meant it. (laughs) No, I think he did. That was class. That's like what Raffle was doing earlier. Do you know where like he's in a long rally and it ends with a perfect drop shot? So hard to do, but it's amazing. Maybe he mishit it and he meant to do a long slice. You got a lock saying who wants risotto for dinner? God, I'll have some. I'm starving. Send some over. Probably won't make it in time. Oh, into the net with the first serve there, Dominic team. Yeah, mate, I'm starving. The bang when did you zero? Yeah, but it's all right for you. You usually eat late. You usually eat about 10 o'clock. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so busy. <laughs> wow. It's busy working. Yeah, your body's accustomed to eating late. I don't have anybody to make me food. So I did it when, three hours it gets... ago. <laughs> It's only when we, and we normally just end up eating at that time. That's when we both finish working, mate. We're just hard workers in this in this house. <laughs> what can I say? No, just yeah. Why late, not have a bunch of beer bloomers. instead of dinner? Yeah, exactly. That's what we got. That's what this is. Dinner. <laughs> That's what I ran to the shop for. Second serve team. Fifteen all. Oh, good return. It's big forehand. Now cross court. Our uh, team tried to go for the backhand finally and bad decision goes wide. 15-30. How Sonego. interesting would it be if Sonego breaks now? And I've been so downbeat on him. I think I'll have to actually... start cheering for him then. Two hours 51 on the clock there in the uh, in the stadium. Oh, 
Big serve out to the Sonego backhand. Oh, great backhand by team, finally. Great return. Oh, what a moment backhand. to hit it as well. It was under a lot of pressure. 30 all now, two points away from consolidating this one. Well, it's not consolidation, is it? Just literally getting to the magic five. That's all he needs to do. Here we go. Rosen saying, why did I stop cheering for Senega? I stopped cheering because he <laughs> lost the second set. And I stopped cheering. It was... He only wanted it if it was in it on his terms in two sets. That's why. He only wanted to be the predictor. No, I'm just, I just don't fancy Come him on. in three, what? mate. Like, hey, against you, team, you, it's not going to happen. You see, you've seen JG's true colours here tonight. With the, he's, his Italian roots, but he doesn't even care if his prediction's wrong. He doesn't no, even no, care I want Senego to win. Still, I ah, want Senego to win. I just not, proved I just, it. It's just I'm a bit disheartened because I don't think it's going to happen. Nah, yeah, yeah, but you've not you're supposed to cheer him on to the bitter end, mate. I'm That's defeated. I am defeated. Oh, what happened to that serve? It hit the net cord and bounced into the crowd. That was never seen one bounce that far off. Second serve. It's into the backhand side for Sonego. Great return. He's hit the net cord again. It's bounced up. Sonego goes big. Forehand cross court winner. Team. Come on. Team holds. 5 3. He's even got wow. me cheering that. That was a good shot. Man, I was going to say, stop cheering, my guy. <laughs> Might put the Austrian flag on. Yeah. <laughs> Sw JG swapped sides completely now. He's in Dominic <laughs> Team's court. 5 3. And that is one game away. Tabanga, stop with this, please. I'm not having you jinx in this stream with you. You won. Team, you oh, won no, my heart. You won my heart. I thought you just said you've won the match. <laughs> <laughs> do not say that. We do not allow early predictions on who's going to have won. Magda oh. said, I said it would be 6-3, and I think I'm right, sadly. So she's saying that she reckons Sanago's going to get broken one final time. Is it going to happen? Well, Second that serve's serve not here. worked for a whole set now, a set and a half, that serve out wide. The one he was acing him with hasn't really worked for a long time. Team, good slice. Sonego goes with a drop shot. Team's in. Hits his own drop shot. Sonego plays it back behind, team. Yeah, Great too shot. good. Well played. Do you reckon he holds here? Or do you reckon 6-3? Yeah, I think he holds. He makes team serve it out. Does, does team serve it out? Or could we be going to a tie break? Stay tuned, guys. If you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button. Like the video as well. Yeah. It's 15 loves to Nago. I'm exhausted. <laughs> but they are. <laughs> Mate, can he do it? Can Sonego do the impossible? Big serve down the tee. Great return from team. Backhand cross court. Sonego goes into the center of the court. Team goes big forehand. Now into the Sonego forehand. It's into the net, though, from Sonego. It's 15 all. Three points away. Dominic team. Yeah, thanks, Garat. You don't have to uh, give us the score. <laughs> it's on the screen. Ben's getting angry with Garat. I, I like it, Garat. <laughs> I like the score there. Anyway, nah, because all. you got to remember that that's ahead of what we're oh, actually yeah, doing. Yeah. Of course, yeah, yeah, got you. <laughs> Oh, and he's tired now. He's moaning. Hits the top the of the net. Game. Federal wants to know, was he disheartened when Apelka beat Karatsev? Did you yes. cry? Yes. I was sad. I had my T-shirt on earlier and everything. <laughs> did you? <laughs> yeah, I did, especially <laughs> for it. I was just watching it on my own. And I was just sad, mate. Oh, it's a great rally here. Sonego steps in. Oh, he's hit the net cord. Oh, it's worked in his favour. Yeah, he says helped sorry. Him. But inside, he's going, come on! Fair, he's, he's, he played it quite well. Mate, <laughs> you got which drink? Please pass on. Well, it's a Heineken. You can see an invisible Heineken. <laughs> you can hear I'm tired, by the way. Cool. Yeah, literally. <laughs> Big serve there from Sonego. Down the line from team. Cross court now, backhand. Forehand from... Uh, yeah, forehand from <laughs> Sonego. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> he it's into the net and it's... Uh, These rallies that seem to be going on 
forever. Team, every... Two points away now. So now he goes two points away. Seems like about four hours ago he was two points away from winning. Now Sonego, oh, team two to, points away. I think the, the rally goes so quick trying to describe what's actually going on. I'm just going to have to go, Sonego, team, Sonego, team. That's going to be easier <laughs> for me right now in this state. Serving, Sonego, tries to go down the team, misses. He wants... The umpire to have a look. I think it was clearly oh, out. It was one. definitely. What are you doing, Sonego? <laughs> please, draws, please. Man. All you're doing is putting time between you and your next serve, which it's is never a out. Thing. It's definitely out. Why are you wasting your time? <laughs> the banger saying some of my favourites. So Pelka, look at that. Pelka. It's miles out. <laughs> I know. The thing is, eyesight's going. He's been on court too long. Patricia's loving it from Good Ireland, I believe. Turn. They're going four hands cross court into the Sonego backhand. Team opting for the slice this time. Into net. We got our first match point, ladies and gentlemen. Three hours played. It feels like forever, but we have a match oh. point and it's going to be going to Dominic team. Sonego to serve. Can he save it? Come on, guys. If you thanks everyone who has joined us for this epically long watch along, hit the like button to help out the channel. Subscribe if you're new, and let's will Dominic team to victory. Come on. And Chris Mears in. Wow. Still playing. Oh, great return. Great volley there from Sonego. He saves it. Still playing. Yeah. It's still playing, Chris Mears. What was your uh, predictions for this one? Deuce. So match point saved. What are they saying? What are they saying in the crowd? Someone's saying something. There's only a small crowd now. Must just be family or friends now. <laughs> family or friends. <laughs> Which in Italy could be a whole just stadium. Just people asleep. Total <laughs> points won. 110 team. 110 Sonego. Oh, good serve out wide. Team guesses it. He goes with the drop shot. Team gets there. He goes big backhand, but he misses. And he kicks the side of the stand in anger. What's he doing, though? I don't How know can you miss that shot? He's a lot better than that. So there you go here. He's saved match point. He's going to try and make team serve out this match. He keeps kicking everything today. And if Dominic team misses team. shots like that, mate. <laughs> What's going on with Dominic? He kicked team? it. He kicked that other thing earlier on, kicked it over. Now he's kicking the sideboard. The flowers nearly fell out. It's advantage Sonego. It's an ace. There you go. He holds. Fair play. The Italian has still got a bit of life left in him. I know We've got we Chris Smith saying, team's going to choke. I don't know if I want it to happen or not. I can't bear it. It's been three hours. <laughs> we had some requests earlier, mate, when you disappeared for a while. They wanted the sinner button, so I had to pull the sinner yeah, button. Yeah, I on saw for... it. <laughs> oh, did you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How? I was watching it on my phone. Oh, okay. Nice one. Enjoy yeah, it. Yeah. No, I'm watching away. you, mate. Just see what you're saying, so I'm up, date, up to date. Oh, mate, you should have seen what everyone else was saying about you when you were gone. <laughs> I was there. I was just watching it all, mate. It's all on the public domain. I know, but some of them I don't put up on the screen. I oh, had the live chat open as oh, well. Oh, you had the live chat open as well. All right, fair enough. I'll let you off. <laughs> all right. God, Dominic team has to serve here to, uh, well, just one service game. One win. Four points. Separates him now in a place against Andre Rublev. Lucky him, eh? I'm, I guess it's guaranteed that this will be a break of serve. And then we will be going to a tie break. And uh, I don't know. I don't think no, it'll be, think... it'll be a break of serve. And then it'll be five all. And then it'll be like 20, 200 juices. And then it'll yeah. go tie break. <laughs> 200 juices first. Then... And then the tie break. On each of the next three games. And then play and then... suspended on match point. No, no. Too dark. <laughs> they have a short rain interval where it's just five or ten minutes. You got Tom Lazar saying, just got home and the match is still on. Everyone's yes, going is. to marathons there, apart from Djokovic. <sighs> but good point, though. This is going to favour Djokovic. He's had a nice little run. Beat Fakina so comfortably. He's probably going to be the only fresh one left, probably the last man standing. He'll win by default. I noticed there was a, quite a lot of people saying earlier about. Finally, Rafa knows how it feels to 
play two hard matches so close to each other and normally has favourable <laughs> draws <laughs> and doesn't have to play so close together. Mate, what I want to ask you ace. is, imagine if we did um, this one, what uh, what Chris Mears is saying here. <laughs> Why is team doing that? He's like going up to him going, squinting. I think it's I think it's in. Yeah, it looks but in to me. I, I like Team's attempt to see if it was in or not. Mate, what do you think of this? Chris Smith saying, imagine if uh, GTO existed when Mahut was playing Isna, Wimbledon. <laughs> and imagine if we started that stream. What would happen? Because we, we, we've never ended a stream early, ever. So I think eventually uh, what we'd have to do is just shift work. Well, you just watch us sleeping on the stream. <laughs> <laughs> it wouldn't be, we, couldn't, we wouldn't do point oh, by point we'd just be vibes. into the net into the net from Dominic team and Karat's back <laughs> it's been five minutes obviously <laughs> oh, got the score back, wrong mate. anyway I know. I know maybe he's just doing it to be nice so he's letting everyone catch up oh there no, we go <laughs> there you go we'll see you later mate Inside out forehand from team. Oh, so they go dug it out. Big forehand team. He's gonna have Ooh. a smash. Oh, he's tried to volley it. Sonego's in. He tried to pass him. He does the second time. Oh, he's just gifted it to Sonego. It's 15 30 now. Sonego does not want this match to end. He still feels like there's life left in the tank. Does he get broken here, Ben? I said he would, but I just, Jared saying uh, he's just tuning in now. Is team playing bad or Sonego playing well? I don't know anymore. I don't, I don't even know what's know. going on. I can't <laughs> even say anything. I think that both are playing well in spells, but both are hitting weird, unforced errors as well. Great serve from team. It's in. So there you go. Makes it it's in two the great points now. Wow. One of the shots of the match. Team tried to rush the net. But Sonego yeah. hit one of his best returns of the match yeah. on the line. To be fair, though, Alum. I think if team didn't even rush the net, he wasn't making that. It was no. so good. No, it was too good. Oh, we've got hiccups. <laughs> wow, great serve. No, it wasn't. Second serve. Second serve on and break point. Is it me or the, the no line judges call anything in this match? Is that really line on the umpire for everything? Oh, he's hit the angle. He's hit the angle, JG. He's the, hit angle. the angle. How has he done that? That is borderline oh, lucky or oh, just no. real unreal talent. They're going to check the mark. I think it was in. It yeah, was just it so him. precise. Yeah. He's, this this umpire feels sorry for him. He's been doing a lot of work today. Up, down, up, down, up, down. Poor guy. Anyway, another break point. 30 40 now. Oh, he's right on there as well. Not quite the angle, just the line, really. Yeah. But still perfectly placed. One more break point. Oh, it's in the net. It's always in the net. Come on. Not on these big points, Dominic. Andrea saying, oh, my God, I'm so nervous. It's into the net and he saves the break point. We're back at juice. Oh, Sonego's got to be disappointed there. He could have yeah. done a lot better on the second serve. He just played it into his hands, into the net. And I'm afraid to say... De Lorenzo, it's not really going well. Um, apologies, Daniel, but your man has just well, let, let this slip slightly. Probably one of my favourite names we've ever had on the stream. We've got Maximiliano Daniel Hernandez Souza. Loving that. Let's go, team. Come on. Team going inside out forehand. Sonego on the stretch. Slice back and it's into the net from team. It's break point again. He's not missed a chance. He's not missed no. it, Sonego. He's going to have another chance. Antonio, the Italians are arriving in their troves right now. <laughs> they want it. They want it bad. It's a break point again for Lorenzo Sonego. Come on, Sonego, saying Roshan. This is a lot of money on this match for Roshan. Great serve. Great return from Sonego. Sonego, cross court. Team attacking the net. He goes volley back behind Sonego. Sonego's gone with the lob. It's in. Team with the tweener. It's too good. He breaks. There we go. We're back. Sonego breaks. <laughs>
I can't believe what we're watching now. It's never over this match, it seems. And Sanago has pulled out some incredible shots in this. In incredible this... volleys. How many good volleys have we seen? And where's Thomas Rock when you need him? There's a tweener. Yeah, off. mate. Where's that? He did say it in the chat. Yeah, mate. But I don't know. I it's feel a bit bad. No, it wasn't he's even not, over he's the not net. here and it was a bad tweener. So yeah, it wasn't over the it. net, mate. It doesn't count. doesn't count. Daniel going, and Diamo Lodi. Come on. We're back on serve now. Five all. 52 <laughs> minutes this set. A good. Oh, that looks in to me, that one. I don't know. My eyesight's going, I think, now. It's so long, this stream. This is crazy. Please, guys, if you haven't already, we've got 300 people. If we Come get on, 300 guys. likes, if everyone likes the video, that would be awesome. And if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. We're going to be bringing you more live watch longs tomorrow. Oh. And then the weekend, we've got semi final and final action. It's into the net from team there with the slice. Fifth. And Sonego's oh. actually leading now. He's oh, leading wow. in the match. Uh, it's been a long time since he was leading. Well, only a, well, 10 minutes or so. He's been leading for most of the match. No, he's not. Not in the third set, he's not. He shouldn't yeah. be behind. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Good return from team. Sonego goes with a drop shot. Team's into the net. He does his own drop shot. Sonego, team with a lob. Sonego, oh, it's no tweener. It's a great volley from team. Yeah, I think he could have done better, though. I was hoping for the tweener. <laughs> <laughs> oh thomas roxy who's making me broke dommy or daniel <laughs> son who's daniel son <laughs> don't know <laughs> i think he well, needs um billy saying so should i cash go. out on 170 quid depends who you got to win yeah that's up to you my, my friend yeah we can't give uh i don't give advice on that kind of thing it's nah, tricky. Mate, that's dangerous dangerous territory Oh, it's a great serve from Sonego. Finally, he finds the serve out wide. How is he making that serve after all this time? Got still, Yunez giving the team a bit of encouragement now. So is Sekar. <laughs> As Pedro is saying, if it goes to tiebreak, team wins for sure. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not sure anymore. Thomas Rock saying it's Karate Kid reference. Yeah, oh, I thought it was. of course. Yeah, because Lorenzo. <laughs> Uh, he looks like the karate kid, doesn't he? Does. Oh, look at that great drop shot. Sonego's goes in and it's 40 15. He's looking to hold He's looking right to now. consolidate and force it to, at worst, a tie break for him. Could we be seeing a final set tie break to settle it? Settle this one. Uh, Roshan's very wise. I made book 1K US dollars, whoever wins now. That's better. We prefer that. Don't want to see you lose 5K. Net points one, 20 for team, 20 for Sonego. Nothing separating these two. Oh, it's not over yet, though. It's not uh, It's not over until, well, I was going to say the fat lady sings, but in Italy, it's probably the fat man sings. There's a lot of uh, opera singers over there, like Pavarotti. It's long, and there Sonego holds, and he takes the lead in this third and final set. Wow. Three hours, nine minutes. And at worst, there's going to be a tie break for Sonego. He doesn't Again. want the tie break because I think he loses it. Team is so good in tie breaks. One of the best on tour. He needs to break here. He has to break here. If you are Lorenzo Sonego, you have to break right now. Wow. I mean, did we see this coming? He had match point. Dominic team, don't forget. Yep. One match point. Went begging, and now he's got to try and get himself to a tie break to potentially see another one. Can he serve to stay in this epic matchup? For me, match of the day. I think this is now surpassing the <laughs> Rafa Chapo match. Yeah, I couldn't believe <laughs> it. But in terms of long, this how long was the other one? The Rafa one. Uh, I'll have a look quickly. One second. It was. Three and a half hours. Okay, so we've so got we're coming... 15, mate. Probably not. It's probably the similar coming up, coming up to the same amount of time. If he holds and we go tie break, I think it's three and a half. God, listen to this. It's quite quite dramatic. All the Italians are back in the chat. We've got Gabriella there. Go to Nego. You're the last Italian player of the tournament. Win for us. Win for Italy. <laughs> Win for Italy. A lock saying pizza's in. Let's get the pizza going. <laughs> I could do with a, a pizza right now, I tell you. 
Do I can do also do go for a schnitzel as well. If that's what they have in Austria, isn't it? Mate, I, could eat, I could literally eat anything. I could eat my own hand. So I could eat this glass in a minute. <laughs> yeah, eat this eat, mic. Eating this beer can. Beer can. And I've been New trying balls. my best to have my phone fully charged. I'm on six percent battery. Oh, so can okay. I make it on six percent? <laughs> Why not plug it in all the time? Oh, there's nowhere to plug it. It's long from Sonego. Oh, what he's, he still always wants to have a look, doesn't he? He's never satisfied with the call. Look, he makes this umpire get out of the seat every time. Oh, oh just keep him in the chair. <laughs> I don't want to see him keep jogging off. It's boring me now. How there many is, times? It's out. I, I think it's just he needs he needs the exercise at some point. I'm, I'm sick of it. <laughs> He's just fat. Leave him in the chair. Stop making him go and checking if the ball's out. It's definitely out. Sonego, come on. Play the tennis. Long the there from Sonego. Very poor return that time. Almost like he He's going to get fatty even... down off his chair to have a look at it again. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's just trying to give him a workout, mate. Here we go. Three 30 love. <laughs> 30 love. Oh. Uh, well, Magdi wants a Sonego break right now. We've got Seca wanting a team win right now. Good serve down the tee. Sonego, good return. Team hooks it wide, his forehand there. And it's 30 15. He's yeah. giving him a window of opportunity now. Big point this one. Yeah, team's kind of running out of gas. I agree with uh, Vikash here. I know he's doing all right. He's 30 15 up, but he's looking a bit flat. I think yeah. both of them maybe are just a bit tired. I think they are, man. The stop start of the whole thing as well. Can't be good for the body. Great ace there from team. Clutch serving when it matters again. Yeah. He knew 30 all It's good be... to start hitting aces just before a tide break as well. It gives you a lot of confidence going into it. And if you can pull, pull together a few aces in it, well, he's halfway there to Rublev. <laughs> Federer's own team out of steam. <laughs> We're going to see the team train. Another ace from Dominic team. Yeah, two aces back to back. We're going to be going to a tie break. Give us your predictions in the live chat. I am going to change everything. I'm going Lorenzo Sonego to win the tie break against all odds. I'm going for Sonego 10-8. <sighs> I don't know what to go for. 7-5 team. There you go. That's my guess. Uh, it's. I just don't even want to pick one. They, I'm just saying that just because I just want to watch it. Oh, and, uh, in the chat, guys, on, what do you have on the fence there? I love it. See, Austria, both lovely faces. <laughs> Two on the fence. <laughs> so we have Seca seven uh, seven four team. We have Great LS Fire shot. seven four team. Great shot, Sonego. What a way to hold the first point. Guys, if you are just joining us, even if you're not just joining us, if you haven't hit that like button yet and you're one of the 370, please do it now. This has been an epic match of yeah. monumental proportions. Show your appreciation for these players and for GTL. And hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Yeah, I really appreciate it, guys. It'd be great to have you on board. And we're about 20 or so subscribers away from 6K. Oh, so if we on, can guys. hit 6K on this video, Ben's going to sing you a special song at the end. I can guarantee it. Ben <laughs> is going to sing after all these hours. So if you want to see Ben, uh, after all the pain of today, having to force a song out of him, hit the subscribe button because he will be singing if we hit 6K. This gets us that 6K, mate. I don't know what I'm singing. Oh, it's a mini break here. For Lorenzo Sonego. Come on, Sonego! No. 25 subs to go, Ben, and Ben's going to be singing. Uh, <laughs> what am uh, I singing? I don't know. It'll have to be uh, either an Austrian song if team wins, or if Sonego wins, you're going to have to do an Italian song. <laughs> Got to try and find an Austrian song. But anyway, great serve there from team. Big forehand winner. And that's how you see oh, he needed uh, that one. under the cosh. <laughs> I can't believe it's all coming down to this now. It's been going on so long, this match. It's 2-1. Sané go up a mini break in this one. Wow. Come on, Lorenzo, says Andrea. Lorenzo, Lorenzo, says Jinx, Jinx. 
You jinxing yourself? Got Lucio saying, if Sonogo wins, I'll subscribe. Come on, guys. Get behind <laughs> us. There's a lot of stipulations in these subscriptions. <laughs> so, come on. Lorenzo Sonego serving 2 1. The mini break in this, in this hand. Break. It's fully in his hands He's right missed now. Missed the first serve. He went for all power there in that first serve. And then there's uh, Ricardo getting in with a bit of Italian. I'll let you pronounce that. Sorry, I'm just off the thing. Uh, Italiani facciamo ci sentire. I don't know what that oh, means. Big forehand. Oh, the volley's into the net from Sonego. What are you Not doing? What are you doing? Back on serve, two all now. And Salah it's always going to be. It's always going to be a, a not a straightforward tie break. No, nah, never. This is going back and forth. Let's go, team, bro. Abbas is saying my prediction: one nine nine to two oh one. I hope it's not that. Please, <laughs> please don't let it be that score. I can't handle it if it's that score. Anyway, Sanego serving back on serve. Filippo cutting in the chat saying Sanego, Sanego, Sanego. <clears throat> he never loses a tie break team says Sonny a lot of people in here <laughs> JG updating with the uh, subs <laughs> team returns down the line from Sonego cross court from team down the line forehand from Sonego he's dug it out somehow he's down the line again he's gone with the lob Sonego with the volley winner it's 3-2 come two. on come on Sonego big point 3-2 and he really needed that. He lost his Massive. concentration a bit. He had a mini break, but he's still up 3-2 in this deciding tie break set. I find it they, they're struggling to uh, to see out the the point each time. His team's digging it back and he keeps trying to finish it off and team digs it back again. Yep. Big serve from team. Puts away the volley confidently. 3-3 three, three in the tie break. Yeah. Can it get closer than this? <sighs> Change of ends. <laughs> I Mate, can't you. bear it. <laughs> Mate, this is horrible. And uh, Sonny saying, thanks for the commentary, brothers. No, I appreciate you it's being in here. Thank you. Yeah, appreciate all you guys joining us. Alok saying, love the commentary, guys. Absolutely love you being here too. Where can you watch the match? Well, jump in our Discord. You can probably watch it in there. There's a link in the description below. Yeah, you don't have to write it so many times. <laughs> Roberto well, there. Go, Lorenzo, go. He's so close. It's a, it's a knife edge. To be fair, this match has been so close. Both players deserve to win. There's been not much really between them. Uh, I'm glad Sonego was able to break back in the end because he does well, deserve it. I knew it was coming. But, but uh, Did you? I didn't think yeah, so. This, I, thought this team match... had that. I honestly thought the t this third set was oh, done no, and mate. dusted, but Sonego had some fight. He's the last Italian left in exactly. Rome. Can he do it for Berrettini? Can he do it for Massetti? Sinner. Can he do it for Travaglia? Sinner! <laughs> <laughs> thought you were going to leave him out then for a sec. Oh, he's hit the line Travaglia on that second Sinner. serve. Oh, great backhand from team. Now he comes in. He's gone with the drop shot. Sonego's in. He passes him. He's got the mini break Come again. On, Sonego's got the mini break. Let's go. That's a big one. Huge for the, from the Italian. I can't believe this match is still going. I'm just so shocked. <laughs> yeah, for people just joining us, Ben will be doing a song if we hit 6K subs with 21 left to go. So please, wow. if you haven't already, hit Miles the subscribe off. button. Let's get Miles to 6K. <laughs> it hasn't improved since when you last posted it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> What's going on? Here we go. 4-3, Sanego. Can he go? It's in his hands. It's in his hands now. Two big serves and he'll big have match serve. point. Great return from team. Big forehand from Sanego. Great shot by team. Goes forehand. Team. It's long and it's 5-3, Sanego. He consolidates the mini break and that is so big. Wow. Well, it's not, not sure if that's his dad yet. or his coach, but he's going mad. Only consolidated if he holds here, and team looks fatigued right now. It looks mentally broken, physically broken, and Sonego looks refreshed somehow. This is yeah. probably doing him the world of good. Winning that point, he is two points away.
first serve incoming on the juice side. Team returns it with interest. Slice inside out forehand from Sonego goes down the line. Team big backhand. Oh, that's the backhand we've been waiting for, guys. What a winner from Dominic Team down the line. Play the wow. button. That's incredible. That was incredible. What a time to finally go for your backhand. Dominic Team, a round of applause for Take that. Take a bow, son. That is, well, clutch tennis and yep. balls of steel. That's all I'll say about that. Dominic team, winner speed, 158. You're going to pay the button? I thought you were going to pay the button. I don't have, no, mate, this is too tense. <laughs> it's not, no, no. <laughs> mate, this is too tense. 158 kilometers team. an hour, that winner. Second serve. This is a huge point right now. It's in. Dom Dominic team, he's looped it up. Sonego's gone for it. It's the team backhand. Sonego inside out forehand. Team backhand. Now the line winner again. Can He's you believe it? it? He's Can you believe it, it? This is ridiculous. Dominic team, how is he finding this? Sorry, otherwise. How can miss. he find the shot twice? He's not done it all match, and he's found two of these big backhands down the line. Both. He's now two points away from the match. But so Sanego, the both. first time both players are both two times at the same time. Both over 150 kilometers an hour. Big serve. Sanego into the court. Team rushes the net. It's the body. It's into the net. It's match point. Sanego. And Come he's on, serving. Sanego. Come on. Sanego to serve for the match right now. Let's do it for Italy. Forza Sanego. Oh, no. All that hard work the Dominic team just put in. Those huge winners off the backhand side. It's one point now. Is it Sonego's first match point? I believe Dominic yes. team has had a match point. This is yes. Sonego's first look at one. He's going to be serving for it as well. Everything is in his favour. Can he get it done on the first attempt? It's into the advantage side. It's a big serve. Dominic team's chopped it up. It's long and Sonego's done Sonego's it. Sonego's won. Sonego wins and he's so emotional. He's roaring. The, the crowd's going crazy. I've got goosebumps. It's amazing. Sonego is the champion here in Rome and he will face Andre Rublev in the next round. Incredible. Commiserations for Dominic team. What a battle he's put in and what a match between these two. It really did live up to the bill. What an incredible performance from Lorenzo Sonego. He was down. He was out. He faced match point. He came back from the brink of going out of this tournament. There was no fans there. He did it for the Italian people. The last man standing in Italy. Lorenzo Sonego is through in Rome. And he goes through to face Andre Rublev. Maybe he can go one better. And go through the Russian. What do you reckon, JG? I just think Forza Sonego. Well, right I'm going to be entirely honest. It's going to be a big, big ass now against Rublev. Someone who's not had a tough match against a good today. He's going to be well rested. These two have been through the mill. Sonego is going to be tricky, but why not? He's in Italy. He's playing well. Let's go Mate, for it. It's incredible. I mean, obviously, yeah. the last time he played, Rublev would have been in that final in Vienna when he had that incredible tournament. Obviously, Rublev beat him in straight sets then. Now we're on the clay courts. Now we're in Rome. Can Lorenzo Sonego do the revenge? Can he yeah. get it? On, and on, on the channel, Rublev. guys, I want to say big thanks to everyone who's been subscribing. We have only 14 away now from 6,000 subscribers. Can we do it live on the stream? That would be awesome. Uh, if you haven't already liked the video, hit the subscribe button. We're probably going to have to wrap it up very soon um, because we're going to have to have dinner and everything. Yeah, maybe dinner <laughs> is and, a very um, important thing. But yeah. we, I think, well, go back to the, the stats because I want to actually have a quick look at some of the statistics from this match. Nine aces, no double faults from Lorenzo Sonego. Eight and three double faults. From Dominic Team, uh, as you can see there, the better second serve points one is Lorenzo Sonego, 
59% to 47 for Dominic yep. team. We keep going down there. Uh, let's have a look at the total points one. 129 to 123 in the end. Wow. The big po- big points at the last, at the death really for Sonego. But anyway, we're not going to, we're going to end it there. Big thanks to everyone who watched. Hit the like yep. button, subscribe. We're going to see you tomorrow for Djokovic. Um, and wait, Djokovic, my mind's gone. Who's he playing? Djokovic. Tomorrow, Djokovic is playing City Pass. Djokovic, City Pass tomorrow. We've got now the Dow Sphere of as well. Uh, stay tuned on the podcast. We'll see you guys then. Well, uh, but if, but mate, good night for now. Well, mate, I think one thing to say when the moon hit their eye like a big pizza pie, it's Sonego. <laughs> He's through. Let's go. Go on, Sonego. All the best in the next round.